whatever the fuck she is. She said yesterday that her laptop was fine and she would be here, so I don't know where she is. She anyway. lied to us. Uh, let's put some dumb music. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah, I see the stream. Yeah. And. Yeah. Welcome yep. to the stream. Hi. Yeah, Evie posted the stream in the chat, so let's wait a minute for people to arrive here. Or not. Hello, audience, whoever you are, welcome. <laughs> I have to wait. You guys remember what you did last week? I became Mr. Clean. No, that was five minutes ago. Uh, we went to the mayor's After house and we almost killed his son. Yeah, basically, yeah. You, f you found out he accident accidentally disintegrated two servants there by trying to make a teleportation circle. Yeah, okay, I admit, at least something. he's trying to do some shit to get out of here. Yeah, Everyone else has done out. nothing. Yeah, most people are like, oh, this place sucks. And he's like, I'm gonna get all of it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he, he, he's like, he's like whiners on the, this, this, this place is like whiners on the internet. They complain about shit, but do nothing about it. Yeah. We're on the internet right now, don't say that. Poison Persona 5. Really? Really? Oh no. It started. I like these voices. Oops. Uh, I'm just posting uh, my link. John and Hulk are both thought you got a call for a fireball from, uh, from the kit. In, in your inventory. Do you have one? I'm so damn glad that I decided to chase after him. We got we got good info. We got some good shit, and I got thirty gold pieces out of it. Not as much as I was hoping to get, but I'll take whatever. I mean, I I got a, a new, I got a new bottle of wine out of it. Yeah. Also, uh, you also heard about the robbery at the church, and uh, you also hinted at some kind of weird weird mage uh, living north of the of the, of the town. Yep, so... And we know the guy is totally creeping on Arena. Oh, yeah. yeah, oh, I yeah. He's exactly... Uh, he's got, like, tons of Arena dolls in his, in his house. Uh, in his room. Le it's a good thing she hasn't gone out of the inn at all since we arrived here. Yeah. Would we even know that he knows she's in town? Oh, no. Oh, Strahd no, will know. not Strahd. Of course, Strahd would know. Uh, Freaking creepy makes as fire as hand. Know, he, he doesn't. Uh, he doesn't know her yet, so he doesn't know she's here. So nope. We should probably keep it that as, way. As far as you know, Strahd took, like, Of course, Strahd knows. He's a anywhere. he's a stalker. Don't take turkey. It's slapping Strahd before he bite it. What? Let's talk about what we're doing to Strahd once we actually get to that point. Right now, we should figure out our next plan of action. Indeed, so uh, you just. It's about early afternoon, you just spent the morning inside the mayor's house. So, what do you want to do? Let's go talk to Arena. We sh yeah, there. we should probably warn her. E even though she hasn't gone out of the inn at all, I we should definitely tell her. Let's. Okay. Probably the, uh, not have you out in the public for a while. At least until we leave the town. Can we heal? Can we take a short rest? Not you. You deserve to be at 1 HP. No. The guy is not, not, not broke. 
Oh, oh, I sorry, I confused your, I confused you guys. His voice for some reason. Oh wait, he doesn't. He hasn't even. Shadow hasn't even been talking. So what am I thinking? Uh, if you want to take a short rest, you may. Yeah, might as well. Okay. So I'm at four HP it. because of our stupid. Spoony cleric bard. You can roll hit dice our then. Stupid NPC who saved our buck multiple times. <laughs> She's the one that killed Gal, basically though. Yeah, she she did knock you unconscious. Gal doesn't need a short rest. He'll be okay. I am currently debating if I should drink. No, not if now. You, if you take a uh, yeah, uh, you level four, so I think you have. Two hit dice, up to two hit dice to roll. Oh sweet, roll, okay, roll. I'll take that. I won't double check it. <laughs> yeah, it's it's half your level, so yeah, you go to two hit dice, and they'll recover when you take a long rest. There we go. I'm only missing two. Oh, I'm only missing like long rest. Are we all uh, doing a rest? You you are doing a short rest to recover via your hit die. Okay. There we go. That yeah. aw. You, you can use up to two. I am currently debating yeah. should I drink. It's too early, but don't drink. Cam, no. Cam, Cam sees you walking towards the bar and motions no. You're gonna need to be okay. Okay. Don't you recover ten HP? <laughs> Dude, <laughs> they're wa They're uh... they're out here. Is freaking water. The L is water. Basically. Oh, think, about the, think about this full HP, I think. Uh, Brock, uh, Wait, I, have my, I have my own bottle of wine here, though. <laughs> uh -huh. So, uh, Brock, can you roll your hit dice, too? So you, you roll your hit dice twice. If you want to. But you can roll up to two, huh? Oh, I found it. Okay, go. five HP. Two. Okay, you recover seven HP. <laughs> really? How complex are your motives? Strahd's motives are complex. <laughs> it takes one bet to change the world. <laughs> or whatever. I don't know. Freaking Twitch chat. Cam's motives are the most complex. Yeah, even I have no clue what he's doing. <laughs> I just want I just want to get all the money. I just want money. That's what I that's my motive some shit. Okay, so you guys wanted to talk to Irina? Yeah. So, yeah, she's not with this mark. Okay. Hey Irina. Do you have like a fan club going on or something? Because it seems like a, it seems like we found another person that has a bit of a thing for you. <laughs> Damn it! I keep forgetting his name. Doesn't doesn't only Evie know about this family? Doesn't only Evie know about this family? No, because uh, you also heard you also heard it from the toy maker since he yeah. when you you went Didn't to the Evie, yeah Evie the the, the freaking extent no you were there too because you bought a straddle no okay at the toy maker store only Brock was not the toy maker since he was he, he, he was at the rest of the oh store. yeah Brock's the only one who has no idea <laughs> this town is definitely not safe for you to stay in. Uh, freaking, what's his name? What's his name? Six Hosni. Mm. Oh boy, what did I do? And why did. Uh, you left hole 20. <laughs> I hit a back arrow, apparently. God, this guy is so damn creepy. He, you don't know him yet. He definitely knows you. Because I seen his room. His room is littered in the freaking dolls that look like you.
Oh yeah, Davis, you weren't there for that. This guy's making bells so this other guy doesn't kill him. You you met Isaac. He's a guy who told to put a ghost mask, uh, a donkey mask on your head when you were arrested. <laughs> oh yeah, he did meet the guy. Yeah, he was like, why 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 is it, why did he not wearing a mask and then the people put uh, like the donkey mask on your head? Yeehaw. Oh, so Brock has a vendetta against him. Oh this no. Is this is personal. Also, lady, what you ask you to kill him so she could take over the town? What? If, if, if he's gone, the, then the, the mayor is a pussy. I'm pretty sure Brock was there for that. Yes. But Brock knows that the one lady wants him dead. I just want to s- Michael. Thank you for the follow. I just want to get it, because I just want to throw it at his face. No, you held on to the horse mask. We made sure of that. Well, we can only cause we can uh, probably assume, I, but this this damn town, uh, this damn town well, yeah, just gets more creepy. Not, wait, hmm? I got the attack for Isaac and I got shit. Oh my, dude, he looks like what's his name from Superman? Lex Luthor. Yeah, he looks like Lex Luthor. Maybe a fusion of Lex Luthor also, and I forgot the mayor too, so that's the mayor. Uh, oh god. And his wife. And his two I'd dogs. Still, I'd I still want the dogs. I want to ride on them. They'd be my trusty steeds. <laughs> but that probably will never happen. No way, hey, thank you for the follow. So many follows today. She was later stabbed with a sponge. <laughs> Wait, what? She was later stabbed with a sponge. <laughs> what is Kirby doing? Kirby's just jamming out to some ju to some tunes. He's my little DJ Kirby. Anyways, That's why I call you Shadow, dude. Talking about brawlers. <laughs> Cause I'm sh Cause I'm so damn shit at names. I put an extra L by accident. Yeah. I think I think we've all hit the point where we just ignore what Kyle says. What? <laughs> okay, I looked away from the chat. What is going on here? Oh my god, everyone's fucking following me. What the shit? Yeah, then day is awesome. Yay! Everyone is on the straw charm. <laughs> freaking straw is you. Straw is freaking charming the entire chat. <laughs> Does his evils know no bounds? Nope. No, he, he, he desecrated soap. His evil knows no bounds. Was I gonna... So anyways... Oh yeah, as we walk... I think it's best for her to... Hmm. As I... I'm just having a feeling that this town is... Definitely not safe, and maybe she should not be hiding out in this town. Unless you want to be cooped up in this uh, room for. Isn't there like a third town? Yeah, or that headquarters for the Raven people we were talking about, or Crow people, I think it was. Uh, no, the Raven people live at the winery, and there is also the town, the town, uh, the town of Kresk, I think it's the name. Do you, think, do you think that town would be any safer than this place? The town uh, is Strahd has a scry on her, right? Yeah, Kresk is the name of the town. I swear, uh, if you do anything to Piddlewink, I'm gonna, I'm gonna slit your throat in your sleep. Also, you remember the. You guys remember that the priest in the village uh, told, uh, suggested you to go to to Kresk, uh, to go to the to the abbey there. Because uh, 
Yeah. There's a, a, we have Saint Markovia, which is the bastion of good. So it's one of the few places that might open us. That's uh, what the priest in the villa, in the first village told you. Oh yeah, Ravioli's going there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm shit at names. That's as close as I can remember his name. Hey, Jacob. What are you doing with all the uh, legs? <laughs> I'm not okay with Kyle threatening me. <laughs> oh my god. Hmm. Glad to know Gail's on our side in this. I'm not gonna do anything. I'm simply outside, waiting. Plotting. Waiting. Plotting. <laughs> For our distraction! <laughs> okay, anyways. <laughs> oh man, I'm so damn sad. Just a fair warning, I'm pretty scattered brain right now so i'm not <laughs> i might not be the best at playing the game right now so but i'm still going with it mm -hmm. i was the first to like pedal link and pedal link like that at first <laughs> he grew on me damn it must be must be because of other reasons too bro <laughs> okay. i like pedal link He's okay. Anyways. <laughs> Love him. Thank you for the follow. Holy shit. Um, maybe because the reason I'm getting so many followers is because I freaking advertised it in other places. Yeah, you probably <laughs> should. Yeah, I, I advertised it in this other D&D &D Discord I'm in and John's Discord. You should also post it on the Reddit D&D forum. Eh, you can post that if you want. I have no access to Reddit. I don't use Reddit. Okay. What? How do you do that? Little bit I can't move. In any case. <laughs> so anyways, let's continue this topic. I completely forgot what exactly is going on here. We're just deciding on uh, where's another you, place you she should probably stay. Uh, you were thinking about the Abbey. The Abbey? No, oh... Uh, the Abbey in Cursed. The mm. Abbey, I think. That was one of the possibilities. You could also, uh... You could ask for Rictavio's help. Yeah, Rictavio's going somewhere, uh, pretty safe. Yeah, he's got his own tower. Or you could ask for the... The Wehraven people. Oh, so we got a few options here of what to do with her. Hmm. We don't really know anything about the next town. We know there is stuff there. All we know is that the winery seems like it wouldn't be. Also, tomorrow is a festival. Shit. You've, you've been reminded of the lot. Uh, I feel like shit is gonna go down during the festival. Uh, because shit that. always goes down during festivals. Festival. Cam is going to stay for the festival. Cam is gonna put on his party soap. <laughs> that was a joke. I'm gonna make sure I help <laughs> the soap obsessed the monk. <laughs> At least. Can I try to craft a party hat out of soap? <laughs> <laughs> We're taking a short uh, rest, so might as well I try. Don't, I don't even know what to roll for this. <laughs> roll for the same thing for like the soap, probably. <laughs> Wait a second. Uh, At this point, you should probably get some tinker tools for soap. Yeah. If you're gonna, if you're gonna need something, you're gonna need some crafting tools. Otherwise, it's not gonna work. I do have thieves tools. <laughs> That's not gonna work for the craft. As a thief, I feel a bit offended by this. 
Like, like what? Isn't there, isn't there like a, isn't there a set for like carving wood? You could probably yeah. use that. Of, of making pottery or something, or oh. tinkering tools or something like that. Yeah. Let me, what? let me see. Uh, here we go. Arson tools. Uh, either wood carving or tinkerer tools. Probably wood carving. Since tinkier, tinker me. Yeah. Can I just get like a reflavored wood carving and have it specialized so it's soap carving? <laughs> like yes. obviously not now. Just I have to buy it later. <laughs> can you even get? We'll see. Can you even get any wood carving tools right now? I'm sure. Because all the town so far has been stuff under twenty-five gold. <laughs> I'm sure oh my God! Tools. He's apologizing to Pitawink. I did that a while ago. Oh wow, wood car maker. wood carving is only like one gold. <laughs> While tinkering is like fifty. Damn. <laughs> yeah, I think your best bet would probably be that. <laughs> still have six days before we go back. <laughs> Once you get on Pitawing's bad side, you're on you're on his shit list. Yeah, that's that's six that's six days from now though. Hey, Every time we can try to murder buckets. Well, I think oh. that's good. <laughs> he he did dump rats on him though. Also we also all we know is that Rebecca definitely does not like Pitawink. Oh no no, Pitawink's a dancer. Ah. He did a little dance. So we completely got off track again. Um. Yeah. Thief is now triggered. A... My thief is my. Th my thief is always fucking triggered in this goddamn hell land. I don't want to ask my neighbor to upgrade my staff in some way, shape, or form. I don't know, make it mid. Make it yeah, especially because then you're just stay with this fucking town. This town is a goddamn shit. <laughs> this place is a fucking shithole. Freaking Mary shit, the person wants to kill him there, freaking Freaking another stalker All these costume festivals that you need to attend. It's like oh. We'll leave into the oh boy. Uh, something's happening. Oh my there. god, what is that username? Whoever you are, thank you. G G G G G G G G G G I, I sometimes hope these accounts are actually real and not just people doing that. <laughs> thank you for the compliment, Kyle. But anyways, if you are real, thank you. Only like two or three people in this town aren't shit. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Not including us. <laughs> okay. Yeah, even within our group, some of us are shit still. Yeah, but you're the hero, so that's okay. <laughs> Aww, thank you guys. <laughs> In all honesty, yeah, Cam is legit the only person who isn't a complete shithead. I mean, even my <laughs> character is a bit... Kind of a brat. Or I don't know how to... I don't know what the word would be. Gal, you've earned some respect today. <laughs> He's the only good character in our group. A sassy lost child. <laughs> can I can I stomp on his foot? Yeah, sure. That won't help. Uh, that won't make that a regular you. make a regular, regular attack roll. Uh, what would I roll? D twenty. Just a D twenty. D twenty plus your dexterity. Okay, so I just roll my dex. Yeah. Sixteen. Okay, you step on, on Gaz's foot. No damaging. Nah. <laughs> no damaging, just stomp on his foot. Even though I'm pretending to be one, I'm not a fucking child! Okay, okay so, yeah, it's Mark has agreed with you that uh, you should leave it down because it's not safe for now. Uh, what do you want to do next? 
Well, I think we should check out the church. I want to go. I want to go see this one that's freaking being made by Porter's dad. Dad for getting his dad. Oh wait, did it break? What? Wait, what did it break? Make it out of stone. They what? Can do or something. <laughs> what the hell are you talking about? What? I don't know. I What? I'm, we, we, we're hearing you very badly and I have no clue what you're saying. I'm a paranoid person. Uh, okay. I think he mentioned something about uh, <laughs> having the you guy do with... something to his quarter staff so that way he could hit enemies that aren't affected by I don't know what attack. He's a wizard! He should be able to hit a lot of shit! Yeah, why are we even attacking your stuff? You're a wizard. <laughs> Besides, he's already busy with freaking camp shoes. Yeah, he's working on my shoes. We don't need to add extra months to stay here. To yeah. be honest, I kind of wanted to go back and check out that little music box with the wolves and stuff. That seems like a pretty interesting thing. Plus, you need your staff. I don't need shoes. But I will probably go back to once we pick up the shoes. Maybe I'll get that. Quite interested in that little toy. Okay. Anyways. Oh Let's just go to the church and somebody stop me from drinking my bottle of wine. Cam is gonna stop Tana from drinking the bottle of wine. <laughs> we need you sober. Better give that back later tonight. Okay, so you <laughs> think... guys make it, to... make it to the church. I think it's official Tana might actually have a drinking problem at this point. Okay, so I'm holding on to the wine now. No one. Tana still has the wine. Oh, I do? Okay. I just told you not to drink it. Fine. And every time I see you, like, pull it out, I, like, give you, like, a... Don't... Don't do it. Mm. <laughs> Whatever, mom. Mm. Oh, wait. Did I get my healing pool back from that short rest? Uh, I am not sure. I only was missing one point. Then you'll get... Well, let's say you'll get it back. Thank I got Fix my TV's coloration. This lost, this sloshing century-old stone church has a bulging steep in the back, and the wall lined with cracks, stained glass windows. The cap, the the depicting pious saints. A fence of wrought iron encloses a garden of gravestones next to the church. A thin mist creeps among the graves. Thank you. <laughs> also, Sorry. chat. How is the audio? How's the audio? Is everyone heard fine? Is the music not overpowering or too soft? Also, this music sounds like it's from Okami. Or at least yeah, reminds me of it. Music too. <laughs> I don't know, it just reminds me of like a mix of Okami or, and Corpse Party. I am not familiar with the Okami soundtrack, so I cannot say anything on that one. Dude, you I better fix that it. after. I forgot to move you. Yeah, where are we? Yeah. Oh yeah, we still gotta talk to those. We should probably talk to those hunters after the, probably late at, probably when we, we're done with everything for today. We should probably talk to them, see what's up. Wait, what is this thing? Uh. Wait, do you want to talk to No, not now. Stuff? Not okay. no, not now. Probably like later tonight or something. Just see what kind of info they have. But right now, let's just go to the church. Yeah, okay. So, I guess you... Yeah, the description at the time was a true description. Okay. Gal won't, Gal won't combust into flames if we walk into the church, right? We, yeah, are, it's all right. we already went to a church. I know yeah, that the I priest didn't like him. This is a different church. Yeah. So this is the St. Andral church named after St. Andral. That we... That's the guy's... That's the guy that's supposed to be the thing. Right? Yeah, you've heard that uh, it's bones... Uh, St. Andral's bones were stolen. So the church is over here. There's no map for it, but... Uh, yeah, the basically say it looks exactly like the other church. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, I just remember. I still have this. Everything was destroyed, so this one is still alive. 
That's that's good, I guess. Also, I still have this skull. Maybe the church can do something with the skull that I have. We found this dead person's head. Maybe you can do something with it. <laughs> uh, okay, so as you walk in here, you see the priest and you see an altar boy. So I, I suppose you tell that to the priest. <laughs> That uh, you found this this skull. <laughs> hey, I don't want it. <laughs> I'm thinking of that, but maybe we should ease up into that situation first. Because that's just weird to walk in and like, hey, there's one with a skull. <laughs> so let's not just do that as our introduction first. Wait, wait, wait. Let's just give it to Guile. He'll it'll be normal. No! I do not want to give this guy. <laughs> No. It'd be normal for Guile to walk in and be like, here, I found a skull. Shrug, shrug, thank you for the follow. I don't know how to pronounce the usernames. Sorry. I'm not giving him. I'm not giving him the skull. I don't think we're getting <laughs> I mean, if anything, I could easily just throw this thing away, but... Eh, it'd probably not be the best idea. Okay, so, uh, also, since you visit the mayor's house, you know that, uh, the, the priest is the, is the brother of, uh, the mayor's wife. Oh! Yeah, and it's also the uncle of, uh, the wizard kid that you found. Ah, uh, okay. Where the fuck is Dingbat? Did she forget or something? I hope not. She said she would be here, so I don't know where she is. She, she probably forgot again or whatever. Thank you for the follow. I didn't get the I didn't get a chance to read that. Oh my god, so many follows, dude! Thank you for the follow. Yay! You're gonna be popular. Yay! You're gonna okay. see a bunch of idiots fumble around in a freaking cursed land. Gonna bring up the I keep forgetting Cam's actually good at talking to NPCs. I'm only good half the time. It takes me a little bit to think. <laughs> uh, so th this is a search of the morning in Rotland, by the way. Which is what uh, most people of uh, Barovia pray to. Ah. Rebecca is currently staring up in space. Yeah, she's probably either praying or doing whatever the fuck a Spoonie Bar does. Well, Rebecca is a cleric, so she goes into the church, she greets her father, and, and, and kneels onto the altar and starts doing a prayer. The said she's doing. <laughs> okay. Something is up with the stream. What, what's wrong with the stream? It looks pretty yeah. fine on my end. Uh, yeah, the stream's working. Maybe it's you again, Trump. Chat has no words? There's, there's words on the chat. Everything seems fine. Well, that's Everything is freezing, but okay. I'm done. Hey, that could be just be you. Yeah. I just froze for a second and then everything started up again. Okay. Yeah, because my internet connection has been pretty stable today for some reason. I'm, I'm hoping it stays like that. So, anyways. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Anyways. I really need to practice on speaking to NPCs and shit. Son of a bitch. Well, yeah, the priest uh, just greets you, so what do you want to tell him? We're asking him about the incident that happened recently, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. So. Which one? Which one? We heard something gone oh, yeah. missing. Oh. Your sister? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, she told us. She, we, well, if she did it. Yeah, we helped her out with a little, little thing, and she also mentioned about that the church needs some help. So we decided, why not? If she said it, then I'm definitely not telling you. 
Thank you for the follow. God. Okay. Davis, leave the room. Gail, leave the room. <laughs> <laughs> you actually agree with me. Intuitively, the church was protected by the bones. Hmm. Oh, so I'm assuming Piddlewink is standing next to me, probably, still? Yeah, Piddlewink just follows you, unless you decide otherwise. Yeah, that's always just an assumption, he's always next to me. Sanctions against the undead creatures, so Strahd and his minions can't penetrate the holy walls of the church. Ah. Sounds very important. It does, definitely. I can also kind of see why people probably want, probably want to keep that bit of a secret. You can imagine that causing a little bit of panic. I take a guess and say Strahd doesn't know yet. Wonder who's the fucking jackass who does the who would do that. You have any ideas who would do that? Oh god. Oh. Can I just face palm? Just... Oh no, camel assist. Yeah, that's oh. that's that's not good. Find out the altar boy is secretly strawdly in disguise. Strad couldn't have gone into the church while this guy saw the altar boy since they were protected by the thing. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. It was a very good disguise. Oh my god. It's the second best disguise. Seems like we might have to question this guy. Oh, damn. I'm flattered, but it isn't on that voice. <laughs> Son of a bitch, I hear him in my vo in my head. Is it okay for us to question this altar boy? Uh, yeah. Hmm. Oops, that's a face thing, though. Mm. I swear if it's him. Okay. Thank you for the follow. Hmm. <laughs> <coughs> 
grave digger. It would be a grave mistake if you were wrong. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> okay, you get inspiration for that. <laughs> Son of a bitch! Wait, do I? Oh, wait, I still have inspiration. I should probably remember that. Uh, no, you don't know the grave digger. Uh, well, you, you just pass him by and walk behind his church and he's busy digging mm. inside. But, uh... Why would you expect him? Chance he might not have realized it and just buried the bones thinking they were normal bones. <laughs> uh, the bones the bones were buried in a crypt, so no, that's, that's not buried. <laughs> They're already buried. Okay. Hmm. Well sounds like something you sh sounds like something that should be done. Oh okay. Would I see you like that. us to uh, put the situation to rest? <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> Was that another pun? It might have been. Son of a bitch. Uh. Where could we find this grave digger? Probably in the uh, grave. I just mentioned that he, he, he just outside, he's, also, he's currently in a church cemetery, which is uh, just outside the building. Okay. Maybe now. Maybe now would be a good time to hand him the skull because I don't want to hold on to this fucking thing. Uh, okay, if you oh, want. Yeah. Also, um, I found the skull. I really don't want it, but I felt like I can't just leave it anywhere. I can't just leave it in some random place or anything, so can you do something with it? I don't want it. <laughs> it's, it's like littering. <laughs> Oh shit! I mouth, I mouth the cam. I don't know what to say. Should we tell him the truth or just? We found it on Guile. Oh my god, I'm so right. glad we both picked this perk. We can mouth to each other in secret code. Well, That's yeah, you can- you Damn it, have Gaul! Have yours. You have yours right now. Clearly it's not yours. I just don't- I just don't know what- Should we tell him the truth? The truth is we found it inside of someone's house, right? <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, he found it inside the hall of Lady Watcher. And we do know whose bones this is. Yeah, it's I just... a it's it, it's a synthesis old skeleton from one of Strat's former guards, who helped uh, kill Strat while he was still human, and then was murdered when Strat became a vampire. He kind of thought all the guards who assassinated him. Thinking about it, it might be a good idea to tell him, but. Because who knows what kind of shit would rain down if if a church has this or something? Well, we found it in his sister's house, correct? No. No, you found it in the house of Lady Watcher, not his sister. Okay. Yeah, the one who's a necrophilia. <laughs> okay. It's like, should we tell him the truth? I mean, I mean, this is a... He's an okay priest. Yeah, he seems okay. <laughs> mm, maybe we should tell him the truth of this thing, but not the truth of where we found it. But then again, he'll be more. Son of a bitch, this was a bad idea! We could tell him that it's been a while so we don't quite remember. I. I. <laughs> Son of a bitch, we're gonna destroy. This is going to destroy. This is going to destroy the church, isn't it? Maybe. Please don't. Please don't. Please don't. Well, I don't know. Does it have guys? I'm gonna stand outside. Make sure I get that. I mean, think about. It, there's there's a reason why it was probably locked up in that fucking chest. He, he just asked you uh, the name and you to put the name on the grave. Basically. Oh, the yeah, name. Well. Oh, do we yeah, know? Yeah, the name. Yeah, do we remember his name? 
you 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 are asking me if Pete with that uh, but I don't remember it so I'm going to look it up so <laughs> we give him the name okay is this guy's name was something something <laughs> the preach actually recognizes that name his name was Leo Delisnia yeah I yeah whatever I'm just gonna call him last Please don't let this bite me in the ass. Because I. Okay. <laughs> Please don't we'll let this up. bite me in the ass. I just don't want to hold on to this fucking thing. Like, in character, Tana does not want to hold on to this fucking thing. Okay, I'm, you. <laughs> I'm just worried this is going to cause some kind of mayhem or something. <laughs> now. It could be worse. We could be burying Dial. I, I think that would be the best. <laughs> I think that would be better. <laughs> You don't want two people with a criminal record who think one's fine enough. Oh, You're the only up. one here with a criminal record right now. Then again, it's only just a, it's only just a skull. It's not like the whole body or something. Okay, right? so he accepts the skull and he says he, he also took a picture to to bury it later. So okay. you want to ask him something else or? Um... Do you have any soap? <laughs> <laughs> any holy soap? Yeah. Oh yeah, holy soap. <laughs> I have soap, but I don't have holy soap. Oh my god, that could be the ultimate Wait, weapon against what, Strahd. What if you got cold water and made soap with cold water? Oh yeah, I could just... Boom, shut up! We could, we could take some... We could no, wait, some don't we have to buy holy water or something? And isn't that expensive uh, as fuck? We could ask for a donation of holy water. I mean, our cleric. Wait, do you think we'll get a bonus or anything because of our cleric, our spoony cleric? Mm. I mean, all this time she's just been praying. Oh, we we all need we all need something. That's for sure. Oh, that'd be very appreciated. Thanks. Oh my god, everybody's talking. Everyone has such long names. Morn Glor Lord? Is that morning the first Lord, so Lotender is the morning lord. Ah, okay. Can I have one of the things of holy water? Yeah, sure. You the real holy water? Oh my god. Uh, it, makes, it makes sense for each of us to have at least one. <laughs> Gal is making it yeah. sound like he's trying to get drugs. <laughs> uh, holy water is an improvised weapon, so I'm gonna assume that. Uh, I'll uh, hold on to holy water. Your proficiency and up is, is up to the DM's discussion, so I'm gonna, since uh, Cam is a monk and Rebecca is a priest, I'm gonna assume you two have a proficiency in holy water. Okay, you know, yeah, have uh, Cam hold the holy water then. Both of them? Okay. Yeah, I have a silver okay. sword, so I'm pretty okay with a with a lot of dead shit. Okay, yeah, and you and you two have magic, so. Oh I yeah, I be... also still have this one alchemy's fire. Wonder if I could try and get more later. Oh well. That stuff is hard to find. It's also expensive as hell. So yeah, definitely keeping on to this thing for a while. Okay. Blank screen. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, uh, do you want to ask something else? Uh, what? <laughs> Whoa! What? Snicker? Snicker? What are you doing? Snicker? Are you, who's drawing I you on the map? See. I can't see uh, it all. I can't see okay, it all. Okay, because you, you're like screen. drawing you on the map right now, so maybe it was just screen. Sorry, I I couldn't see it all. I yeah yeah. yeah I was, like, I'm trying to think if there's any <sighs> info that he might know that we can. That we should probably know of. Sorry, I really couldn't see. I thought if I drew something, I'd see it. Yeah, it, it, it's okay. <laughs> I thought it was just a blank screen the whole time. Would he know anything about the mayor's bodyguard? Or would it just be generic uh, info that we already know? I think at this point we know everything we're going to learn about him. 
I'm really curious, Sorry. why does he have a freaking... Yeah, I knew it. Oh, oh, you don't like. I read that as I don't know. It's just like, what? <laughs> yeah, I guess. No one likes this guy. Brock, I thought we told you to go outside and you complied. Yeah, that guy gives me the creeps. Like, really bad. <laughs> hmm. Ugh. It's like a lizard. Did you say he grew it back right away, or did it take, like, some time? Uh. Okay. Hmm. So we could potentially have some form of regeneration, but it's very slow. Uh, it's unknown why 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 is um go back so. Hmm. This guy just gets more creepy in a second. Man. Hmm. Uh, anything else? It sounds like you're trying to push me to try and say a certain thing, but I don't know what it is. No, no. No, I'm just asking if you want to ask a question or something, otherwise you move on to the next thing. I know, I I just, know. I'm just i not good with thinking about this stuff. Well, that's okay. I don't have any questions. I think we're okay. good. Okay, oh, you can still come back later if you want. Yeah, we could come back later yeah. if like, if we get any other like tidbits he mi that he might be able to delve deeper into. Daniel, you can't convert him to your religion. <laughs> God. <laughs> it's all because I gave him that fucking skull, <laughs> isn't it? You got the impression you just started off in the back. <laughs> so like, <laughs> Tana's pissed. <laughs> Tana's just really pissed. Slowly tries to reach for my bottle of wine. <laughs> that just me off. It doesn't. <laughs> Hey, what do you want to do? You want to talk to the grave digger or something? No, it's my bottle of wine. Get your own. Get boy. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. I I run off into the graveyard. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I bottle of wine. He just finished uh, digging grave. Uh, he, ac he actually has a character portrait, so give me a second, I'll share it with you. Uh... And that's my way of moving on the plot. <laughs> you guys better not jump me. Ah. This is like the most normal looking guy I have. <laughs> Hey, this guy's fucking so damn generic. He looks like he belongs in a. He looks like the protagonist to a generic anime. With, with, without blue hair, though. Dude, he looks like what's his name from Attack on Titans with that shirt. Uh, Levy? No, no. Well, I yeah. guess. Yeah, he does, but I'm talking about the main character. But. Oh my god, he yeah. does look like Levy, too. Oh my god. It's kind of weird seeing such a normal looking person. Did anyone chase after me, or am I the only one out here right now? Yeah. He just looks at you for the moment and he moves on to the next case. Ah. Mmm. 
Fuck. Started. <laughs> Guys, suck at NPCs. Snicker, bring your character out here with me. Help me. Snicker. Uh, Snicker's muted. Where'd he oh, go? Sorry, I forgot. I didn't realize I was muted. Sorry. Oh, <laughs> well, no, I followed you outside. I followed you outside. Okay, help me with talking to this NPC. Um, can you make sure? Doesn't drink. Yeah, I'll make sure Kevin doesn't drink. Mm -hmm. Don't take my bottle away. <laughs> I'm just telling you not to. <laughs> I just, I just realized. Don't take my bottle away. Oh my god! And people, and people think I'm a kid. Oh my god! It made it worse. <laughs> my bottle of wine, mine. Shouldn't give oh, alcohol yeah. to minors. Don't drink. <laughs> I'm, I'm not a fucking minor. Fucking years old, you fuck jackets. <laughs> oh, did we get the grave digger's name? Uh, his Levy. name is Levy. Millivosh. <laughs> Millivosh. Yeah. Who's the guy we're looking at right now? What do you know? I kind of would. I kind of just want to call him Levy. Yeah, I, I don't know name, so I, I'm just... Hello, back. name here. Yeah, like, I said the name, I just don't... <laughs> what, you don't give okay. children now, wine? Now it's written there. Now it's written there, so I can... I can actually... Minivosh? Minivosh. Yeah, now I can actually type it out. Uh, oh, yeah. good. Rock came with us. And Guile. Oh, God. Always ignoring the tie fling. Those damn tie flings, I swear to god. What we uh, should we get straight to the point about the investigation or should we mm. try to dance around it? Mm, okay, this guy, he's. The, the priest mentioned this guy has a temper. Also, we're. Also, no music's going on right now. Let's, let's make uh. him like us first. Uh, I, I, gonna... I think that's probably good. Get him on, so get on his good side before we start accusing him so of we're shit. Give him Tana's alcohol, is what you're saying. No. Yes. yes. Well, how how no. else do you plan to get him on his on our good side? I don't have anything I can give him. I need this. No, I could give him one of the sleep ties, and if he falls asleep, I could tie him up, and then we could investigate him then. I don't think the priest uh, will like that. Yeah, yeah the, he would and like that. And the fight's like for last eight hours, so. To help us actually progress when we do this. I'm just hugging onto the bottle. Mine. It's the only thing keeping me sane. You know what? You know what? In the spirit of... In the spirit of Devious Net being here... Yes! No! Oh god. In the spirit, uh, in the spirit of Dee Dee. <laughs> you know what? Let's pretend that Dee Dee said that. Because she's pretty much straight to the point. Let's pretend she said that, not Cam. Yeah. That's the type of thing she'd ask in this situation. Why don't you pretend to be her since you know how to handle her? <laughs> yeah, pretty much! Pretty much. Yeah, that's that's definitely Rebecca. I just kind of wait, wait, wait. step back okay, a bit. Uh, make an intimidation check. <laughs> Me? Yeah. You think Re it's probably Rebecca to have to do that? I wasn't trying to be intimidating. Okay, <laughs> okay, okay. You want me to for Rebecca, maybe? Yeah, please do. Please do. She has the higher charisma. Yeah, I don't have charisma. Okay. So She's the spoony bard of the Rebecca. group. Plus three to intimidation. Ah! Uh, 13 
Ah, she rolled a 20, though. Damn it. Damn it, that, that, you, you just needed to roll 10 to succeed, so it's fine. Ah, okay. Oh, really? Mm. Well, that worked. And I still get to keep my bottle of wine! Mmm. We heard you may have stolen something. How do you respond? I'm still desperately- No! Don't yeah, burn my so wine! I need it! Like I just realized, am I still I on a hangover right now? I'm probably still suffering from a hangover, so I probably still have a major headache going on. Huh? Well then. Well, he's being honest. I think we should at least give him that. And he's feeding his sister. I can appreciate that. Wow, that was pretty damn fast. Okay. Hmm. One second. Miles doing something in the chat again? Oh, yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> I'm letting Kraft handle that situation, whatever Miles is doing. It's not my deal right now. The coffee maker got as a Dutch name for some reason. Henry van der Voort. So many vans! I think van is kind of like an add on type thing. Yeah. Van in Dutch will be translated to off in English. Ah. Uh. Like, Strat of Zarovic. Basically. Hmm. I'm actually feeling really pity for this man. Oh, Dingbat. Yeah. Hi. Oh my Dingbat. god. Dingbat, you're here! We just pulled a U. And it worked. Yay! Very well. <laughs> it actually really did. So congrats. Welcome aboard. <laughs> you did something good without being here. <laughs> well, uh, should we catch game. Ding- Should we have Dingbat- uh, cat Should we tell Dingbat what she missed so far? We found yeah. out this guy might have stolen something, so we directly asked him immediately, and it just so happened to work. And I'm starting to feel really- I'm actually feeling really pity for this guy for what he had to do. <laughs> yeah. So basically you guys were investigating the stolen bones of uh, the saint of the church. And you found out that the thief was actually the grave digger. Who uh, stole it on behalf of the coffin maker. Because he needed to feed his family. Yes. Mm. So... Cam is justifying the fact that he did it for his family and not wanting to punish him. Right now. Do you know this is the truth? That he did it just to feed his family? Uh, you can make an inside check if you want. He is telling the truth. Mm. He, stole, stole... Uh, he stole a uh, bones of a dead saint of the church, which protected the... Uh, the area of an of an dead creature. Who asked him to do this? The coffin maker. The, the, the coffin maker. Okay, because I was kind of a little distracted. Why would the coffin maker want to do that? Do you know where we can find okay. this coffin maker? You know what? Hmm. I kind of want to do something. I kind of want to do something. 
asking for directions to the house really quick. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay. Once you're out where where it is, so okay. you will find it. Uh, let me check the map. Hmm. It's iron and six. Ah, uh, the coffin maker's house is here, so. I'm Need gonna make it. Need a direction before someone does something. Okay, so. The church is here. Like. Coffin maker's. Want to ask him about something else, or...? Yeah, Evie had something she wanted to do. Okay. <laughs> this is kind of tying into a little bit of my backstory, so... Oh hmm. boy. Ooh, character development. I recommend stealing shit that you can easily just trade into the store. Don't steal something that that fucking important. I'm just stealing the coffee can for no reason. Even though I have no money. <laughs> I just start walking away. Okay. <laughs> You're gonna give so much money he's gonna steal again to get more money. I, yeah, it's just like, I already got so much damn shit right now, it's like, and, like, hearing this, hearing what this guy, why this guy did this, I'm like, eh, might as well, I know this, eh, don't think anything about it, I know, I know, I know the deals of that kind of shit. Okay, so you guys walk away, uh... Like gives him, like, a few rocks, you know. <laughs> then yeah. we give it all wrong. <laughs> we all get it. Bitter Wicker's gonna make a dance with Jim. Let's, let's see if he wants to. Elder will probably try to kill him. Okay, let's see what Bitter Wicker's falls. I may, I, may I may like to be greedy and steal all sorts of shit. But, hmm. You're nice to the poor people. Yeah! I have some, okay. I have some standards. He's and like called the 17, so he's doing well. Yay! He's getting better! I just thumbs up Piddlewink. Yeah! <laughs> Piddlewink, Rag thumbs back. I wonder if I'm getting any better with the pan flute. <laughs> Roll and see. Ah! Everyone's getting, everyone's getting better. This is surprisingly good. Woo! <laughs> We're turning this graveyard into a freaking circus. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay. Don't hear? You wanna do something else? You guys wanna go kill the coffin maker or you wanna do something else first? Either you guys. Hmm. Fedora, is it okay if I try to persuade him that everything will be fine? What? What will be fine? Everything is what he's saying. He wants to convince him everything will be fine. For him? Because he's going through some crap? Does something have to end with killing Don't someone? sound like the mayor. <laughs> I put Saudi instead of Saudi. Saudi? <laughs> you guys just try to kill people all the time. Let me have this. My time okay. to try to kill someone. Uh, you done? You want to go to the coffin maker or do something else? Mm, I... I think we should probably we should probably check out this coffin maker, but we okay. should probably let's see. Wait, did we ask why does the coffin maker need these bones or something? Uh, you can, but he doesn't know. He just the coffin maker just told him he needed the bones, but uh, yeah. he doesn't know. 
We can maybe assume it was Scrod related, but... Wait. So, I'm trying to remember. The bones were secret, and... How did yeah. the coffin make... He... Did he told him... How did the coffin he, make... He, hmm. he, he told the coffin maker about it, and the coffin maker told him to steal the bones. Oh mm. yeah, can we ask him how he learned about the bones? Uh, he, he learned it from the altar boy. <laughs> God dang it, altar boy. So bad. This is why you don't share fucking secrets like this! First okay. Yeah, yeah. Altar boy. Hmm. Guys! Yeah, the, the other thing, two people can't keep a secret if one is dead. <laughs> so, hey. Do you think we should go with the sneak sneak plan? Sneak sneak plan? Sneak sneak plan. Uh, Make uh, me invisible. I would like to sneak sneak as well this I time. Did a rest, but you okay, I'm gonna move you to the coffin maker's house first. Okay, gotta uh, find our tokens. Yep, I yeah, see. I need to put, put your tokens on the map first, so wait a second. Ooh, small map. There we go. Ta -da. Becca. Mm. Come. Boop. Girl, Mark, hmm. and Pedalik. Everlasting darkness. Uh, do you guys see something? Yeah. I see my character, and that is it. Okay, that's not good. Yeah, okay, give me a sec. Black everything else is black. I can't see through the windows. Okay, I can see. Them. Okay. Well, the windows might be boarded up. The windows are actually bothered up. Son of a bitch, I can't, I can't scout. Yeah, give me a second, uh, I mm. can box, you should see now. Uh, same for Dingbot. You got sight Dingbot. Does everyone, can everyone see now? I hear. Put the intake music. <laughs> okay, so let's. Okay, that's good. We need a plan of action right now. Uh, wait, first I'm gonna give you the description. If you do our ever so trusty plan to make Hannah invisible and see if you can find it, and then come back and then break it into This uninviting shop is two stories tall and has a sign shaped like a coffin above the front door. All of the windows shutter are. Closed up tight, and a deadly sign surrounds the establishment. I could sneak in on one side, and Tana could sneak in on the other. Let me see if there's uh, a. You take a look around the house, but there is only one entrance. Oh uh, damn! There's a tall ass house. Long ca. It's a long house. On the second floor boarded up. Yes. Okay. So. Oh, wait, no, there is, there is actually a back entrance. I'm turning the entrance. Oh, there oh. is. Yeah. yeah then we this could have one, right. one person could go in the front and one could go in the back. Okay, I see. Tanner, do you want to go in the back? Sure. Uh, well, wait. Uh, Either. Don't good. Like, wait, uh, this, this, wait, this area is actually the main entrance. Oh, that's uh, oops. Entrance? Well. Yeah, yeah. Uh, hmm, so. This area leads to, leads to the workshop, so. We can have. Uh, yeah, this, this door is not locked since that's the entrance of the store. It's not locked? The entrance uh, yeah, is locked. Yeah, this one is open. Okay. Oh no, wait. I'm like, actually, it is locked. I'm saying no. <laughs> All the doors are locked. <laughs> no, no. Sorry, oh, noob DM. <laughs> noob DM. <laughs> oh no. We're not, we're not here during the open hours? I imagine it's still like midday or something. Yeah, it's early afternoon. I it's guess like he two, closes two, up. Two, two, uh, it's like 2 3 3 in the afternoon right now. Okay. Hmm. So if I'm gonna go in invisible, are you guys just. Are you guys still gonna go in and see what's going on? Try and talk to the coffin maker while I snoop around? I was thinking I could snoop around too from a different entrance while they talk to people too. Mm, I'm okay with that if the wizard's willing to use up two of his level two spells like that. Uh, I was gonna say I don't need invisibility because my stealth is pretty good. 
Okay, what's what is your stealth? Well, my stealth is six. Uh, what the so fuck? Why are you higher stealth than me? Because I have a as far as you know, the coffee maker lives all over that. How is the monk more stealthier than the thief? Because the monk has a lot of dex. What the fuck? Even if he isn't even the best things you can do. I haven't opened any locks. If that was in character, I'd be so damn furious right now. I can't open any locks. If any of this was in character, I would be furious. Well, at least I have a seven to my thief tools. Okay, the thief so... tools six. Uh, what do you want to do? Yeah, what's the plan of action right now? Cam wants to open the door and go in. I want to be okay, invisible the first. Is the, door, the door is locked on the inside. Cam has thief tools. Wait, are we just going to go in there without turning invisible first? I don't need invisible. Actually, no. The, do uh, the, it's... the door is not locked. The door is is blocked. Oh. oh. Using, a, using a thief tool would, would not help, I do Yeah, and I probably a strength... Making a strength check would probably make too much noise. Could I try to use my soap sword to do that thing where you, like, slip it between the side of the door to try to... I have two crowbars. We're not, we're not trying to break in, though. We're not trying to break in. <laughs> then, what? We're trying to pick the lock to break in. We're not trying to break the door to break in. Whatever. Just, just turn me invisible. Uh, yeah, but first, uh, how do you plant winter? Okay, I'm invisible right now. The, both, both doors are barred. Oh, oh they're both. both? Yes. Oh, I was, maybe it wasn't clear enough. So, okay. oh. Let's say, let's say, yeah, you, let's say you hasn't, he hasn't cast invisibility yet. So yeah, uh, I wasn't clear enough. Yeah, both doors are barred. Could we try knocking first? Sure. Uh, Rebecca, so you look would on... you like to do, Rebecca, would you like to do the honors? Bang bang door. Yeah. How much does a battering ram cost? You look on the door. You have someone yelling at. We're closed. Go away. Anybody want my crowbar? We could say we found a dead body. I don't care. I'm not open for business. We found several dead bodies. Hmm. <laughs> 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 Why does that get you? Make a persuasion check. <laughs> no, he's not open for I am not open for business, okay? We found Get an the army. Fuck up Make a persuasion check. I'm saying I'm convincing him, yes he is open. <laughs> Are you sure you're not open? <laughs> this game's so damn stupid. <laughs> Can we ask when you will be open? Check to see if I can fit in that this is actually important. Is this exactly what? Ah, uh, important. You know what? Uh, which which door is he at? Sorry. Which door is he at? Uh, it's coming from this door. Uh, which is which? Uh, oh yeah, you don't know what's inside. Okay. Can yeah, I just room. pry this door open and hope he doesn't hear it? Okay. Uh, and can I assume I'm invisible? Like, uh, we didn't do the invisibility thing yet. Well, you well as, far as, as far as you know, he's the only one. He's the only one in the house. So. Yeah, as long as you avoid him, you're fine. Okay. Let's just. Can we assume the wizard used the uh, invisible on me now? Okay. Well, if you're prying the door open, he's gonna get rid of it. Okay. Uh. No, propane the door open, there's no point to attack us, so... Okay, so... I'm yeah, fucking doing it. You get that advantage, right? Yeah. 
Okay, we will need D in the door stack start to break. Mm -hmm. But it's making some noise though. Son of a bitch! Davis, you're talking to him at the front door. You need to get back here. Keep distracting him! You're trying to ah. be persuasive. Keep like, distracting him. Do like I? You said, sir, this is important. Is that something you should do? Persuasive? Is it? Okay, uh. It's a... Make a persuasion, uh. Davis, make a persuasion roll to persuade him to stay be, uh, to talk to you. And to distract him. Well. <laughs> <laughs> Rebecca, do something! Rebecca! Rebecca, roll! Roll persuasion! You yeah, have too charisma! Late, too late, too late, too no! Late. Fuck. Important ask. Oh no. Look, I won't lie to you. A classic starting line for Rebecca. Uh, son of a bitch. So, if you hear him behind the door, he have to try to break in. Uh oh. <laughs> well, time for someone else to get arrested. I'm invisible! I'm invisible, so they won't know. Oh boy. Yeah! This is not the time for this song. This is time for the other song. Yeah! Uh, yeah, put something else. Unless yeah, this Evie's music is so damn out of place! Unless Evie's about to die, we don't need that song. It's a little bitch. So is the door not open? Is the door still not open? Well, it's it's like half open, so you can open it, but uh, well, he already fo he already detected you, uh, so you can pry it open. But uh, yeah, you pry the door open, and you, you see the the coffin maker right in front of you. He doesn't see me though. Can I slip yeah, through or anything? Hmm? Can I slip through? Is it uh, big enough for me? You probably can. Wait, uh, dynamic lighting. I'm just gonna remove this. Up. Right, you should see two now, I think. Mm-hmm. I see it. Okay. S so do I have I the ability to slip through? Uh, you can, yeah, but uh, since you uh, make a stealth check to see if you make noise or not. Son of a bitch. You can't see you, but you can still make noise if you mess up. <laughs> uh, hey, hey, I'm invisible, so I get, so I get advantage, right? Let's say you do, so yeah, yes. it doesn't notice you. I got a 20! Okay. Okay, so uh, you're inside like uh, the store part of uh, the... The house, so you see uh, several coffins, which are on display for... Basically, it's a... Uh, yeah. Hmm. Okay, I'm in here. Oh, what do I do? <laughs> hmm. A range has a real up about the floor of this musty L-shaped room are 13 wooden coffins. Okay, now I need to think of what should my next plan of action be. Can I try to sneak in too? Well, Evie pried open the door and the door just flew right in front of him. Uh, I, he's like, what the fuck just happened? <laughs> and, uh, you can see it's clearly afraid of something, uh, Evie. Mmm. Oh my god, I could pretend like I'm a ghost if I want to and shine. No, this, this, this is not enough. Can I pretend? I wonder, can I pretend to be the ghost of the bones that were stolen? That would require deception. Okay, uh, if I'm you just want wondering. This, you, you can if you want. Mm, I gotta think, uh, I gotta think. What should my plan of action be here? He's over here now, Davis. We have to go to the other door. Or you guys can continue to distract him, get info out of him while I search around. He's at the back door. We're not distracting him at the front. Oh, Davis, wait. Okay. Well, Cam's over here now. Yeah, I walked yeah. over. Uh, so, Evie, what do you want to do? I'm trying to think! What is... I'm just wondering what Cam... Is going to do now. Hold on, we could have Guile come up and ask about the religion again. So bitch. Cam, what languages do you understand? Um, I speak common and elvish. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's going on! Why are you asking this?
Oh god. Oh no, what's he doing? It's kind of looking at hand, he's very afraid. Uh, sir? Sir, we need to talk to you about stuff. Hmm. I'm still seeking you out. The door is open, so you could enter if you want. Yeah, he's pretty much screwed now. <laughs> Don't! Yeah, I think I'm just gonna step inside. Spot, okay? Because that's the most distracting thing I can do right now. Okay, uh, do, you, do you guys follow him, uh, Guy or Rebecca? You, you guys are not moving? Mm. <laughs> We're going inside the back door, by the way. I think you are inside the door. Yeah, Rebecca, just do. You guys do whatever. I'm gonna snoop around. Wait, one, one thing at a time. So, I didn't uh, meant to step into there. Oh my god, you guys have him surrounded. Okay, so what do you want to ask him? Rock. I don't think reverse psychology is gonna work. <laughs> Son of a <laughs> Brock Guild! I just face palm so damn hard. Just face palm so hard you take one damage and stop being invisible. No! I'm not sure which. I'm not sure. Bones! Fucking bones, you like, jackasses! I don't know who he's responding to. I'm gonna let Gal and Brock just go with him. Can you give me the um, mirror shards? Kill what? Let the mirror shards. I can play with it. I can use them. No, don't. Use them for. Don't. I, don't. I plan on trying to convince him that whatever he has is cursed by exploding the mirror shards and nearly killed us. Those, those... I don't think this plan is going to work. No. <laughs> it could work. I don't know what you you can't stand Tanner's voice. Time to take a chill pill. <laughs> oh, that's just insulting. Yeah, I think he's got a zombie problem. Someone just insulted me in chat because of my voice. That's rude. <laughs> don't mind watching this, but I can't stand Tanner's voice. Time to take a chill pill. <laughs> Have any? I ran out a few days ago. Oh, he's dead. Vampires in this house? Vampires. Oh. That's all I need. We can put him under arrest. That was out of character. <laughs> What are you talking about? Tanner's voice is great. I'm not even putting up a voice. This is just my regular voice. Oh boy. Uh, I have no clue what's going on in this conversation right now. I think he's horrified because he accidentally brought some vampires home. Somebody just calm him down and try and get him to talk about what the fuck's going on here. Because I'm so confused. Hold on, he's explaining something. He's explaining something. Let him explain it, Davis. Uh, 
the sound of agreement. That's why you never do business at home. Oh god. Yeah, as you know, vampires cannot enter if you don't invite them. Oh, <laughs> don't, do no. don't do business at home. Oh no! Well, you better move then. This house is fucked. <laughs> so this is a one-time deal. Once you invite him in, he can he can always yeah. come back. No, you have to invite him back in if he leaves. Uh, I don't. I'm I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's the way it works. You have to invite him back in if they leave. Yeah, I I think that's how it works, but I'm not sure how it works in this world though. So you did as a guest. We can let him about how many. Uh oh. About how many? Uh oh. They're all in this these coffins, right? Six. We well, gotta do we something. We said they're upstairs. Can I sneak upstairs and see this? Uh, like, can I scout it? Without them noticing me? Brock, stop trying to break the fourth wall. Wait a second, so... Uh, first I'll finish this conversation, then you, you can sneak. Ah, they're just gonna crit, it's okay. We fight them all, right? I think his base, I think his safe bet is to just ha have him move into the church. I'm assuming that keeping the bones at the church was not enough to uh, block them from coming, right? I think that only so blocks the, the church. Right it doesn't block the entire town. Yeah, it's blocked the area around the church. Oh no. Is something something's gonna happen to the church if we don't bring these bones back as soon as possible. I think it's fair to say that if that we take the bones, he's going to die. We could yeah. just bring him to the church with That's us. Safe. He'll probably be safe there once the bones are back in place. Yeah, he'd be safe at the church, but he'd never be able to leave. <laughs> Until we defeat Strahd. Well, who knows how long that could take. <laughs> yeah, probably a month. <laughs> uh, probably a few weeks, I guess. About how long do we have till they wake up? It is midday and they're usually nighttime creatures, so. Can we kill them one by one in each coffin? Gonna peek outside, see what time of day it is. Uh, it's about 3 p.m. now, so let's say uh, sun goes down around 8, let's say. So you got about uh, 5 hours. Oh, that means it's summer right now. I'm assuming we couldn't just stake them once and say they were dead. I was assuming that it was fall or something. It's too specified, so... <laughs> I know. But assuming by when the sun sets, I'm 8 is around summertime. Could we run over, grab the vampire hunter guy really quick, or did he already leave town? No, he's still in... No, you're... He's it's still... Like... He's at a tavern, right? So you... Good, go talk to him. No, uh, it's actually a pretty good idea. <laughs> um. Hmm. Though, we don't- we want to keep his identity a secret, though. Yeah, that's the issue, but... Well, you like, can ask him for advice, though. We already had asked him plenty of advice about vampires, though. 
Oh yeah, we do. He, he doesn't know the heat, though. <laughs> we should probably tell. Yeah, maybe we could tell him about the situation right now, and then quickly come back here. And we couldn't just kill them immediately by staking them while they were asleep, right? Wait, can we? Uh, hmm. Can we just burn the coffins they're sleeping in right now? Would that kill them? Well, I, I, well, just burn the entire house down. <laughs> this house is fucked, anyways. Uh, and I have burning uh, you can't do that, actually. Oh my I, god, that's yeah, a viable yeah, option. It's broad daylight, so if you guys burn the house down. Wait, no, but Someone's but Strahd has the country. entire country cl clouded, so the sun wouldn't really affect them. No, no, the sun does affect them. Uh... It's just a truck and control of weather, so... Oh, so he just yeah, happens to have it sunny there. right now? Yeah, it's it's less sunny than normal, but uh, sunlight still affects vampires, so... I do think it's fair to say that he doesn't want to burn his house down, though. So. Yeah... I'm just, I'm just finding it funny how that's an actual viable option right now. I think our base, best bet is to talk to our ravioli friend. What do you think we should do, Rebecca? You haven't said much in a while. I say we loot the place. Oh yeah, we need the bones. We can't burn the house down. Just yet, until we get the bones. Okay, we need to get the bones and then run off. Okay, he's leading us to the bones. I think I'll follow uh, him. Since I can actually okay. be stealthy. Okay, so... Yep. I'm gonna I follow can actually him. Be stealthy, yeah, so you, I'll, you, follow up, him. I'll move you too, so. Does he know I'm here? Uh, you can tell him if you want. Mm, I uh, think I'll stay. I think I'll stay quiet. He, te he tells you don't go there. They're inside that room, and he goes to the other room. Mm -hmm. Okay, follow him to the other room. <laughs> Is there anything out of yoink? Davis, we're being sneaky. Davis, stay, stay down. So we're burning down his house after we get the bones. Possibly. Maybe. Yeah, that's a possibility. Wait, won't we get in trouble with the mayor or we'll, something we'll if we do it. that? We'll let yeah, Davis do it. Well, if you, if you, you could tell the mayor there were vampires in there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure you'd be like, yeah. Dude, there's a spider in the house. Burn the house. <laughs> that's basically what's happening right now. He's in his bedroom, uh, it's a mother's bedroom, holding... Mm -hmm. okay, so, I'm taking the fall for bringing the house down, right? Either you or Gal, because you're the ones who can start fires. Please do. I don't, I don't want to, I don't want to be thrown in stocks. Okay, so, he, he shows you a compartment where the bones are hidden. Okay. So you can take the bones. Yeah, I'll pick up the bones since Evie doing it would be weird. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Is there anything I can yoink in here? Anything of interest? Uh, not really. There's a bit of money, but he, he, he's the one who takes it. So, yeah, it's basically spare money. Ah. Okay. Uh. Okay, so he's going back downstairs. Uh, make a still check, you know? Yeah. Me? Yeah, you too. Also, Davis, since he's upstairs too. I thought Davis didn't actually go. I don't know. He, he, he's stuck in his. He upstairs. moves his icon. He moves his thing at random. Oh, I don't boy. think. So. Yeah, I don't think he I is. Do. Wait, do did you go upstairs or not? Uh, uh, I want to follow them, but um. I'm don't. Oh. Just stay downstairs. Just stay downstairs. Okay. Where did everyone go? Oh, you didn't go. We, we were we were doing things, plot things. So are we actually gonna burn this house down? We're gonna we're gonna need a backup plan in case the vampires arrive. They're gonna be running around the village or the town, murdering people. So I think we should take an empty coffin and turn it into a bunch of stakes. I already discussed the possibility of staking them in their sleep. I don't think it's gonna work. I think the best choice is yeah. just to burn their coffins. Take a coffin and just carve it into a stake. One for each of us. We don't have any carving tools. I was already told this by God hours ago. 
Well, technically, we're in a freaking uh, coffin house, so I'm pretty sure he has a few carving tools. <laughs> exactly. <gasps> Dude, you could carve your soap. Um, do we have time to carve out steaks, though? That would take some time. You could, uh... You... He's got quite a... Um, good amount. Does anyone have a blade? Uh, I'm a fucking thief, you jackass. Oh, mine is soap. Uh. Don't you have a silver sword? Yeah. Uh, no, nah, no, you need a, you need a wooden stick. You need a stick, so anyway. Uh, it, I have a rapier, two it, daggers, silver okay, sword. Okay, you sword. you can make a few sticks uh, quite easily using the wood. I would say it takes about ten minutes. Can I, I see what's in this door? This door just uh. This was just the dining room, so it's nothing special. What if I took the bottom of my staff and carved it out? Good. Oh. Yeah, well, he already made the steaks. Pay attention, he made, man. He made steaks. How many steaks did we make? Well, I'm hungry. Steaks and some fires. <laughs> okay. I want. I'm hungry now. I want some steak. <laughs> Anyways, so are we actually gonna burn this place down, or are we gonna get info from Ravioli? <laughs> I think we got all the info we can get from him, to be honest. You got five steaks for the steaks? No, he is the expert, and we're just assuming just burn the house down and it'll be done with. We don't know if this will spread the rest of the town. Could we roll insight to see which plan is more likely to work? Because you gotta think, we might set half the town on fire if we do this. I have a bunch of insight. You can roll inside, come if you want. Okay. Yeah. Uh, burning the house is viable. <laughs> There's a lot of wood here, so yeah, it would burn pretty well. <laughs> you could set all the coffin on fire, or you could, we fucking uh, come uh, doing it pretty easily. What if I set each individual coffin on fire and then burn back? You'll I be wasting your spells. I think it would be easier just to burn the house down. Well, e fireball is a country, and uh, oh, yeah. of course it's so. They could easily put all the confusion on fire in it if if you want. Can we make sure that this doesn't go into a fire where it's completely uncontrollable? Uh. Like, uh, how close is this house to other houses? Or can we, like, manage to contain the fire within that room? Yeah, yeah. The, 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 the house is a bit uh, separated from the rest, so actually the chance of its spread is pretty low. We roll natural one on that chance. <laughs> no, 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 it should be fine now. Okay. No, the the uh, wood carver is completely this. fine with this idea, right? Yeah, the coffin maker was fine with just burning the place down, right? Okay. Well, uh, basically, Strahd can get inside your house, so his house is kind of fucked, I mean. <laughs> when Strahd can get inside your house, you're like, oh, what the fuck am I supposed to do? Yeah, <laughs> let's, yeah, you know what, you know what, yeah. <laughs> Guys, it's time you're, It's time for you to, sh it's, it's your uh, turn to shine. You're just, just, you're just asking uh, that, you, that you protect him <laughs> for, for a while, because uh, the mayor's probably gonna be angry. Should we uh, alert the mayor? It's, it's not your fault that the vampires got in. It's not your fault that the house burned down. It's all Davis. They're should rough. we alert the mayor or should we just try and keep this like this was an accident? <laughs> we we um. <laughs> we can tell the mayor, but after after the house is burned down. We could blame it on our wizard and have him thrown in jail again, though I'm pretty sure he'll probably get hanged by then. You would probably get hanged. We could blame it yeah. on Guile since it'd be a first offense. You uh, would get you, hanged. If you're gonna start burning the house on, you're going to best eyes for a serious offense, seriously. Uh, unless you actually tell him it's. You probably be arrested unless you tell him there were some piles in it. I guess I'm. I'm just. If we tell him that there's vampires in it and we burn the house down, everyone will be safe. We could also tell him it's to make more space for the next festival. <laughs> Dude, that would actually work. I think that would actually work, would it? Nah. No, that wouldn't. 
Ah! I would say that would actually work. <laughs> Dude. Oh my god. Okay. So, should we warn the mayor first and then burn the place down? We should burn it first. The mayor might stop us. We could get the entire town to burn it down. <laughs> I don't think it'd be a good idea to bring a straw to the mayor. How about we just light the place on fire and deal with everything afterwards? I'm invisible, so I'm gonna stay out of this shit. I don't want to be thrown away. I don't. I don't. This is this is gonna be bad. I'm gonna, leave, I'm gonna leave and let Guile and Brock handle burning the place down. Uh, we should probably tell the wood maker to grab anything of value before we burn his house down. Yeah. 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 That too. That too. Uh. Okay, so he can always rebuild his house out of all the coffins he made. Yeah, so basically he puts some more, he, he gathers all the carving to into a box and he, he tags a box on site along with, with a pair of change clothes. Did he take the crafting tools or could I take some crafting tools? Yeah, you can take some if you want. Woo! You do want to. Can I be, be burnt down the house? So we're not going to tell the mayor, the mayor first. No. Yeah. Not. The, the vampires might wake up before we do that. We we could have just one person walk over there and warn him as the house burns. How about then? Why well, don't we? I don't know. Me and, Rebecca could go. Me and Rebecca could go say that the house is on fire because vampires. <laughs> you see, there was a, this giant spider in the house. <laughs> There was a vampire spider. That's basically it. That's, this is exactly the same line of thinking. There's a there spider a in the house. Spider. Burn it. A vampire spider. <laughs> Let, let's just... If I am getting out of here. Okay. If anyone should go to do that, I think Rebecca should be one what of the What if we blink Strahd? Mmm. Mmm. Strahd burned the house. Yeah, people would panic if if we said Strahd did this. <laughs> this is basically Strahd's. <laughs> Technically, Strahd did do this. He's the one who started this chain of events. Yeah, but they would doubt the mayor even more, which would probably cause a revolt if we get rid of the mayor. Eh? Like this isn't. And again, we don't really want to keep the mayor, but then again, we don't want the watch lady walk being mayor. But we don't like the bodyguard anyway because he's after another party member. Can we just leave? Can we just leave this town? <laughs> but I need to get my shoes. Son of a bitch. Yeah, and if Mark and his sister aren't going to leave until like the day after the festival. I could make Rebecca invisible and have her fake being Strahd to say that. No! I think Strahd is a bad idea at this point. Pretending to be Strahd in any situation is probably bad. Hell, him himself might pop up just to fuck with us. Meow, meow, motherfucker. High Arctic smoke. Rebecca has a plan. There you come. Oh my god, Oh god, Strahd's stalking to us. There's a special place in hell for people who impersonate me. Yeah, right next to you. Uh, anyway, so, uh... What do you want to do? You put the house on fire or not? Or you just want to leave or whatever? I'm all for lighting the house on fire. In all honesty, how strong would these vampires be against us? We could easily just kill them all, really, but still, the house is fucked. Six vampires, that's more party members than we have. Yeah, yeah. we don't know how strong those guys would be, really. Uh, from what you've heard, vampires are fucking strong. Yeah, let's burn the house! We can't take these guys <laughs> on. Even there's even there's simply vampire spawns. You guys have wanted to burn something since the beginning of our journey together. Why, why don't we give them their wish? Sure, but I just feel real. I just I feel, feel like the. Go crazy. 
No, I'm pretty sure. There. Yeah, I think the mayor would be fine if we just said there was vampires in there. Though he'd be. Though I feel like the woodcarver should probably hide from the mayor. I feel like he should hide from him. Uh, is everyone outside of the house? Like, is there any way we could protect yeah. him from the mayor? If. We could hide him, uh. We could try to hide him, like, uh, you got friends at the end of something. Hmm. Good. Like, you're, you're currently hiding hiding Irina there from start, so. <laughs> Just rent out the entire. <laughs> oh my god, he's drawing it. <laughs> he drew, he drew a little flame! He drew a tiny little flame! <laughs> we're actually burning this fucking house down. Oh my god, we're actually fucking doing this. I'm just gonna grab Piddlewink and just walk away. Like, let's not... Let's just go away. Oh yeah, where is he? He's out front with me. He's out front with me. Oh yeah, I'm invisible. I can. Can he see me when when he turns invisible? No. Oh. But uh, if if he does, uh, you'll be invisible. But uh, yeah, sneaky mission is. Oh yeah. Oh, I'll I'll become uninvisible once he becomes visible. You're not sure. Yeah, let him. It's, it's, let him. He needs it more than I do. Okay. I'm just putting the, uh, Dracula music on since you 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 guys are burning on vampires. <laughs> yeah. Um. I'm no longer invisible now. Okay, then. so, yeah, the woodcarver is invisible and he's hiding from the mayor, so you told him to go to the inn, so he's gonna go there. It is done. He is visible. I just hope, I'm probably assuming that the, that the innkeepers aren't gonna tell them, isn't gonna tell him all the secrets, they're just gonna hide him. That's it. Yeah, okay. Okay, so... So, we should probably leave? Or are... Yeah, we should... Oh, yeah. Should... Cam is leaving right now. Yeah, I am. I am miles gone by now. I am miles gone by now. I'm just like. Cam gonna... left with Tana. We fucked up. We fucked up. Oh god. Oh yeah, we should probably. Yeah, let's hurry up and get to the church. And I kind of want to stay. I really want to be hidden right now. So I'm just gonna. I'm doing whatever I can to make sure I'm not out in the open right now. As we go Can back to the church. Okay, uh, all of you make a stealth check, so I would say if you don't want to be discovered. Okay, that's what I was gonna ask. Oh god, no! Okay, you have inspiration, oh, right? Um. Yeah, yeah, so you can take it 22 to 19. So, uh. Oh! Fuck! Okay. I'll go for Rebecca too. We're fucked. Anna, Anna, is Rebecca is here. Rebecca, are you here? No, she's... She's not, I think. She's kind of here. Think back. Yeah, well... Think about when you're here. I'm just gonna hold for her then. Fuck. <laughs> oh, there she is. Oh, you did a good stealth anyway. Yeah, is it a good roll? It's fine. Is is this a part? Is this a group roll? Yeah, let's say it's a group roll. So, okay, you managed to be relatively sneaky as you go away. I am so on guard right uh, now. I am so on guard. Okay. I didn't burn, uh, a, house I didn't burn a house down. <laughs> okay, where was that house? Where was that house? Uh, okay. That house was. Uh, uh, there. Yeah. Oh, uh, can we just put like a little. Okay, so yeah. Let me give me a second. There. <laughs> yeah, but. Oops! Don't stop burning. Oops! And, uh, as you guys start leaving the house, you, st you, you kind of start hearing cries. Like, <laughs> <laughs> uh, please don't. And the house doesn't catch yeah. anything else on fire, right? So, you you actually see a vampire uh, jumping out the window and oh, trying shit. to hide it to, to hide to another house, but he gets turned to dust by by the sunlight before he reaches another place. Okay, yeah. if people see the vampire, yeah, yeah, the wood, the wood guy should definitely stay hidden. Coffin, coffin guy. Yeah. This is kind of inappropriate music. 
That's oh, no. really is. <laughs> That's pretty appropriate. Burn, baby, burn. This going burn. Oh. <laughs> I'll take Toasty. the vampire skills in one go, though. <laughs> How much experience do we get from that? Vampire level. No, vampire level a lot of XP, actually. <gasps> Did we level up? Probably. Uh, but, but we'll be at the end of the session. Okay. Sweet. We basically leveled up. Not, not, uh, at the end of the session. Okay, okay, sweet. Okay, so let's let's go back to the church. Let me check how much of vampires were. Yeah, I, I, I went to the church. Cam went to the church. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, you guys all make your way back to the church. <laughs> so, you deliver the. Uh, about the priest. Yeah, I give him the bones. I say we found them. We found them. Here you go. Enjoy your sacred bones. So, one vampire spawn is worth 1,800 HP. Times six divided by five, so yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> we leveled up. Yes, you did. Sweet. Yeah, per vampire. Oh my god. Divided by five or divided by six? It, six. It's times six divided by five, so. That's two thousand one hundred sixty experience each. Yep, just for the vampires, and you, you guys have been doing a lot of stuff too, so. That was pretty good. Yeah, yeah, you guys leveled up with this. Well, we 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 are gonna level now, though. We say you level up at the end of the session. Yeah, it's we don't really need to level up. There's no real battles going on right now. What time is it now? Uh, let's say it's about. Uh, by the time we get back, it's like four or five p.m. Mm. Yeah, we're definitely gonna be. Yeah, we we definitely can't leave the town at this rate because if we <laughs> we don't know how far the next. Rest, night, uh, safe rest space would be. Uh, yeah, the next town is like a day away from a day travel away, so. Oh, great, we're gonna be stuck in this fucking town. Hooray, we get to be here for the celebration. Well, at least we got the bones back. Uh, what's happening at the church now? We come back, that's, sure. that skull becomes and eats everyone. <laughs> The bones. I'm so dead. As long as you say nothing, Brock, we should be fine. Nobody saw us leave. I'm just happy to put this case to rest. <laughs> Can you take away his inspiration for that one? That's the last one today, I swear. Uh, what the fuck? Okay, uh, as soon as he puts the bones back in the grip, you... I feel like something, uh, a good emotion coming out of it. Ah. And yeah, the church once again becomes hallowed count. Which means undead creatures like vampires can no longer come in here. Yay! Your tortured screams coming from the basement because some undead things snuck in. <laughs> yeah. Shouldn't Gaul be screaming a, a, now? A zombie out of something instantly die or something. <laughs> we get one more experience point from it. <laughs> the priest also levels up. Hmm. 
Please don't kill. Please don't support us. Um, Do we want to tell him the full thing, or are we going to... Nope. Mm, I feel like it might be okay to say. Uh, well, he, he's, he's probably seeing us at all. He's probably seeing smoke coming from the, from the house now. Well, it's a, it's a there good was an infestation. He, yeah, he had an infestation problem. He had an infestation the, the problem. Pre, the, the priest is a good guy, though, so... Yeah. Like him, yeah. Okay, uh, the dumbass... The dumbass got tricked by, by the fucking bat and sent him in there. Invited him to the house. This is why you don't do business at home. Uh, he's basically made a deal with him, and it's like it's, if, it's like if, bah. I won't kill you if you do X. Yeah, so he had to burn the house down because there were uh, vampires up in the second. Yeah, we well, don't know yet. Well, right now we told him to hide. Really. We told him to go into hiding in case the mayor is like, what the fuck is going on here? And please do not tell the mayor any of the shit that we had to do, because I'm pretty sure he would be upset about the fucking house. Please don't tell! No! no, no he oh! He could talk him into okay. Okay, thank you. I guess we could tell him where we told him to hide out for a while. Meanwhile, if that's the case. Scarlet oh, yeah, Scarlet's gonna be mad. Oh, that's nice. Maybe it'd be best if he hide out in the church. Yep. We take, oh, this fucking Irina here. You really can't remove your record, Davis. <laughs> that her crack. Mm. Okay. We'll tell him that you that he can hide out here. We can't remove your record, Brock. Yeah, I was I I was pretty much assuming that the, his best places bets of hiding from Straw is in the church. That's what I I've been assuming that. Well, it was not some kind of international church. That is Though me making that bat pissed off kind of makes me feel a little happy. Take that, you jackass. That's always a good day. Mm-hmm. Fucking bat mess with me. I'll mess with him. <laughs> hmm. So now what? I think now would probably be a good time to reconvene and figure out what we're next, our next move is. The only last thing we can do right now probably is check out the basement. I think it, I think we don't have enough time to check out the wizard. I don't think we should check out the wizard. Uh, hmm. the, the, the wizard is about uh, north of Tana. Uh, there's also a... Uh, there's also a Vistani camp over here. Oh, yeah. That I told you about. Hmm. So we got the camp, basement, and the wizard. We could also take a few days off of adventuring. Just sit around, do nothing, let time pass. Hmm. Maybe pick up the shoes. <laughs> Good. I don't think Strahd will let you do that. Yeah. Strahd would probably get bored of us and just kill, straight up kill us. Well, he wouldn't straight up kill us. No, but isn't that what he did to the last adventures? And look, and look, you, look him, look you in his castle or something. No, uh, that'd be boring. Yeah, I'd rather not be locked up. I'd rather wake up to one person being a vampire, <laughs> but we don't know who. Oh my god. 
It's probably Davis. Why yeah. me? Because you're the most <laughs> evil. No, no. That would be Kong. Not Kong. Not you have done more evil shit than him! Oh yeah, the shoes. Yeah, I, I want my shoes. <laughs> They're very nice shoes. Well, you can always come back for them, and uh, the valley is not big, though. Even mm. if you go to next one, you can come back here. Uh, you, you'll have to, because it's the only way to Strauss Castle, anyway. Ah! <laughs> I'm gonna assume language? we're going to the in for now. Mm. Oh, yeah, if that's could... okay with everyone else. Mm, sure. I can't think of anything else right now besides the. Okay. I wanna check out that fucking basement! I can still do that if you want, but okay. for now I'm moving back to the inn. I'm not helping with the basement thing. I could just turn. No. I could just turn invisible and sneak around and scalp, scalp it out. Brock has to help you with that though. Yeah. And I don't think he has enough slots now. Unless he takes a short rest. Yeah, we all need to take a rest. Uh... Oh god, would you like some healing done before we take a long rest? Hmm. <laughs> well, if you guys take a long rest, you get, you get to level 5 though, so... Mm, yeah. If you take a long rest, then that means the day of the festival. Like just, just do. I'm just trying to think. What can we do for the rest of the day? Like anything productive? We could go to a store, but that's about it, really. Rebecca could make more holy water. Oh yeah, Re Rebecca could do that. Oh, I have crafting tools now. I could make soap weapons. We can also get some info out of those hunters. Get a idea of what's the surrounding areas like. We never, uh, we never talk to them. Little. Indeed. Also, maybe I can sneak around the town pickpocketing. <laughs> Thing bet hasn't said much. We should probably give her a moment to voice her opinion. Oh god, I want to go pickpocket shit now. Worry, Hold on, I got I got a dog barking. And my brother's getting pissy about it. Can I can I roll to create the, another soap long sword? Well, yeah. <laughs> we get I have the tools now. Yeah, okay. So, what do you want to make? Soap longsword. What about hey, soap well. Uh, you already know how to make one, so I would say, yeah, make a tinkling check with your tools. Uh, and I'll do the tools. Yeah. And I'll do the three. What's that? Would that be? Dexterity. Okay. You are not proficient to... though with it, so you cannot have proficiency. Um, I need to set up the thing for that really quick. I do not know how to turn on proficiency with that. Oh wait, that's tool proficiency. That's fine. Okay. So just roll dex? Yeah, I just make a dex to dex to check. Okay. Oh, now it lets me use the 3D dice. <laughs> Then, and uh, the sword you attempt to make it doesn't break. It breaks. Yeah. Okay. Thing bet you want to work on holy water while I'm working on my soap weapons. What does Thing bet have to do to make holy water? Uh, she has to spend 25 gold and one of her spell salts. Level one. Changed my mind. <laughs> Wait, let me let me check the rules for holy water. I need twenty five though. All right, I need all my. 
Uh, just use uh, check your ass to use silver file, that's worth 25 gold, so you would have to go bu buy silver basically. Okay, yeah, uh, Brock gave all his money to Rebecca. Okay. Don't know, how, don't know how wise that choice was. Okay, I'm back. What did I miss? Brock gave all his money to Rebecca. <laughs> also, good. Wait, what's going on? I failed to make another sword and Brock tried to give money to Rebecca so she could make more. Can I pickpocket Rebecca to get those playing cards? I still haven't gotten those playing cards off of her. Also, I'm sorry if there's any background noises. Somebody's messing right, with shit. Right. So, can I try and steal the cards? Um. So, uh, what do you want to do? You want? She wants to pickpocket Rebecca. Okay. Yeah. And what? Uh, make those... a of fan, and I'll become a perception. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, well, I'll make, I'll make a perception check. Finally, I got a good roll. Will the joke finally end? Okay, do you actually manage to see those, those freaking cards? Yes! You finally got your cards back. Congratulations. <laughs> Sweet. Uh, also, Evie, you wanted to talk to the hunters? <laughs> Brock, Brock, never give your gold away without a guarantee that it's being used for what you think it's going to be used for. <laughs> Let this be a lesson to you. So Rebecca's refusing to make holy water? Because it costs 25 gold. And well, I we're, out of, we're out of silver power, yeah. So you would have to go to a blacksmith and get some silver power. Oh, yeah. And I don't know if there's any blacksmith. Or you could find, if, if you find a uh, silver power somewhere, you could use it for, I guess, but, uh, yeah, you don't have some white now. Hmm. We could get some info of those, uh, two hunter guys. I just gotta think, how am I gonna approach them? Unless I just sit right next to them and start drinking. <laughs> yeah, and maybe they start talking to me. So if you find all the music, say so. Huh? <laughs> okay. Where's my token, anyways? Ah, <laughs> everyone's upstairs. Yep. There you no go. reason. Uh, no, those are uh, lady watchers. So no. I know, I know. I'm just trying to think. Around the Even in role-playing, I'm awkward as fuck to talk to strangers. She's not quite drunk yet, but she's still not sure where she wants to be in the bar. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know what? At this point, I probably took a t few swigs now. Also, yeah. As you, as you enter, uh, basically, Rictavio uh, uh, talks to you. Eh? So. Huh? You know what? Yeah. You know what? It's sick. I finally took a few swigs. It took a few swigs. Should I roll? Should I roll a constitution or just assume I'm drunk already? Uh, nah, it's fine. fine. You can roll make a constitution roll, but uh, I wasn't related to the coffin maker. <laughs> Good job. I got tell that sarcasm or not. <laughs> hey, he's being serious. You guys killed six vampires. Oh uh, yeah. Woo! Well, I won the combat, so that was, a, that was actually a pretty good plan. For no <laughs> Why would you want to directly fight six vampires? I don't know, I'll live yeah, a little. Uh, actually, a lot of. Uh, a lot, I saw a lot of posts of Reddit like, well, my, my party went against the vampires and we got the TPT, like, what? <laughs> they never thought of just burning the house down? A lot of people just rush in and, uh, and get, uh, get slaughtered, because vampires are freaking strong, huh? Ah! Uh, 
Uh, they don't have arsonists in their party. But it was my idea to burn the place down. It was my yeah, idea to burn their coffins. Yeah. Guy wants to burn down every building we walk into. Let's be honest. Yup. Search <laughs> Yeah. Most buildings we walk into. Yeah. Where well, they're good. <laughs> Fake church. I mean, burning down the house work worked against Dio. Huh? <laughs> Next, we should burn down the castle. <laughs> yeah, castle is made of stone. Don't you know? <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> we could we could we could cover it in Greek fire. Hey, everything has a melting point. <laughs> also, Strahd is a powerful wizard, so, that po so he probably will to the castle walls. <laughs> ah, I killed the dream, will ya? <laughs> we could burn the bridge down, so we can't leave the castle. How can I turn into a bad person? He can't leave whenever he wants. He can't leave using the bridge, though. <laughs> He can't fly, he doesn't give a fuck about the bridge also, I guess. <laughs> it's an aesthetic. <laughs> okay, so uh, what do you want to in the end of, by the way? Oh yeah, uh, basically uh, you, t you also told uh, the coffee maker to go to the church, so he left already, yeah. <laughs> so, and... To this... Uh, some say that that house is still burning to this day. <laughs> In the middle of the fucking square. It's been like, it's been like a fire like an hour ago, so it's probably still on fire at this point. Yeah. Yeah, we should have caught it on fire. We should have, we should have waited until tomorrow. That would have been a real blast during the festival. Eh, uh, nah. We don't want to make a scene during the festival. That's when the mayor will be watching. Everyone, everyone. I'm probably a little drunk, so I'm just thinking of this shit. <laughs> mm. Okay, so... Uh, Wolf Hunters, what do you want to ask me, Diffy? I don't know, I'm just... You know what? I'm just gonna sit right here. Okay. And just... Just drink my wine a bit. And the dog's still barking, and I don't know what to do. Well, I mean, I don't hear it. Mm. Is there anything Brock could buy for a silver piece? <laughs> We're uh. just snickering at. I heard her came from Rebecca. <laughs> Technically, I have all the money in the group because I'm the no, one no, stealing no, everything. Shit. He gave all his money to Rebecca. Ah. <laughs> Don't call her small. She doesn't like that. No, she doesn't like being called tall. <laughs> hey, I understand my height. It's when people. It's when people call me a chap. Ed. Ah, oh, you think so? Ah. <laughs> and recently I've been drinking a lot lately. Then I don't think I can handle it that well. <laughs> also, don't listen to the hack. I think he's stupid. This is music. It's too adventurous. I like it though. It is good. I just wanted a few joys of. Ah! I can definitely see! Okay, uh. <laughs> also, it's always the same guy talking to you, to you, and you get the impression the other one just repeats the, the other words like, huh, but joys of Barovia, like. Hmm? So, yeah. The one guy's talking, the other guy really isn't for 
finishing the other guy's sentences. Huh. He's that guy that fin that says what the other guy's last few words were at the end of every sentence. Ah. Yeah, basically, yeah. Okay. Ah! You two buddies! Finish each other's sentences. <laughs> hmm. Ask them what they hunt. I was going about to say, oh, what you hunt? Game, game and stuff like that. Ah. I don't, I don't think I've run into any yet on, on our way over to this tab. But I, I see a bunch of heads on the gates, I think. Luck is all over the place. So there's really that many damn wolves. Regular? Oh boy, werewolves are a thing. Oh. Uh. Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> Stay away from this. Even as a drunk, you need, don't need to tell me that. <laughs> so, no, in our, knowing my luck and my group's luck, we're probably gonna run into them. <laughs> that's not gonna be fun. We have some already cracked. We just. I just, I just take another sip. Hmm? Do you know Elvish? I only know Nemish. What do you think I am? Not a... Not an elf child, I'm a... No. I'm loyal to our dear lord. Dear... Your dear lord? Yeah, he sounds he sounded a bit sarcastic when he said dear lord. Oh, I'm drunk, I can't take sarcasm. The damn bit The cuss of cuss. <laughs> God I love talking like a drunk. <laughs> it covers up my actual my actual exactly <laughs> dead and needs to oh, got smoke in the chat. Hello, smoke. It's Dougie's been in the chat. Dead and needs to Wait, what? Wait, what bruh? What'd you say? Wait, Tana needs sleep. Then Oh! Okay, you forgot a period or a comma there. Because that kind of makes it look weird. What, Morgana? What are you talking about? Uh, he's just saying that uh, I need to go to sleep because I'm drunk. And I'm like, no, I don't. I am mm. perfectly fine. What time is it? It's like, what, five? Nah. Let's, uh, let's say you, you've been here for a while. Uh, Kamal's been crafting, so it's about 8 p.m. or something. Ah, uh, definitely do late to do anything. Unless sneak around shit or, uh, 
Yeah, I'm probably too drunk to do anything good. If you wasn't too adventurous, you probably wouldn't have been drunk. I uh, sh probably should have drunk. There goes my idea of probably pickpocketing the town a bit. <laughs> oh well. I got enough. I got enough shit. So anyways, uh, back to the... Do, do we just see these guys just ramble around and just see him drag him off? Yeah, I dragged you off. I was serious about that. You're upstairs now. No. Oh, a book. I'm just looking at them and I just... Accept... Okay. God, it makes me wonder how did we survive this long. <laughs> Yeah, and a bit of a headache. But, but we can handle ourselves it somehow. I just realized this guy I just realized this guy is the same last name as first name. So there's all that of it. It's pretty bad it blunt as fuck our Tafling's a Tafling. The wizard, I have no clue what kind of mental problems he has. Our monk is a pretty chill guy. And Piddlewink... Eh. He's my buddy, I guess. What are you guys doing? <laughs> okay. Go to bed. I gave him a, I gave him the bark soap and then left. <laughs> so hold on, let me look back at those like the wolf werewolf conversation going on. Okay. Yeah, okay. Get back uh, to the werewolf. Now uh, here's some appropriate music. <laughs> so anyways. Huh? So what were we talking about? I, I, I don't know. Ah <laughs> uh, yeah, where was. What are you doing back down here? I walked down. Uh, I'm, I'm just going to ignore you. Yeah, Cam's going to bed. So, wait, Karen's is that third town, right? Karen's okay, is uh, the town west of Fairfax. Ah, uh, uh, we're going to be heading there probably within a few days. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. And the, the town's like a day away, right? Yeah. Hey! I don't need to be babysit! But I would avoid getting off the road if I were going. Yeah, I can imagine. Considering all the bullshit we already seen so far, nothing is safe in this bless. I ain't doing that, need a babysit. You dad go to bed. Mm. 
し。I can pretty much assume what goes on at night. Probably more than the usual shit. This is like. Besides, like, the usual shit, it's like, is there anything else that goes on at night? Besides the. 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 stuff you would expect? You think Tana's hangover? I've been hungover this entire day in in reality. Oh, again. <laughs> A bad headache all day, really. Hold on, I'm trying to think here. Because I'm shit at, I'm shit at this shit. Okay. Like, hmm. Is Gaul still- is Gaul down here with us? Or is that just his token? I think uh, Gaul's still there. What is- I was just one- I was just wondering if you're- you're actually there or is your token just there? Ah, so, okay, so you're actually there. You're just- you just been standing there just awkwardly, quietly. Haven't said anything. Here. I'm trying to think if there's any more info I should probably ask or like maybe tips on werewolves. Hmm. Yeah. one. <laughs> Don't let <play> them. <laughs> ah, very much. Hey, bad wolfes. Like, you never know when this info will be coming handy. Uh, I'm assuming the uh, silver weapons? I, I have one. Yep. Uh, I guess if we ever have to fight one, we'll play like a five. Got our two dumbass wizards. And I have me a civic I thought. Oh mm. uh, yeah, you're still here. No, I don't have that picture. Uh, I'm getting it to you, Davis. Just give me a sec. <laughs> what? Dial 
Bill, stop trying to ask for an apprentice. You're only level four. Well, we could, we could not help. I need a friend. No one's gonna be a princess. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is getting awkward. I think I should probably stop because I, I'm shit at this. And I'm probably getting way too drunk to be able to hold a conversation soon. Okay. Well, if you want to ask something, you can do so. But, uh... Okay, so you spent a relaxed evening there drinking, I would say. Yeah, you know what? Yeah. Uh, and, yeah, if you want to go... If you don't want to do anything else, then uh, I'm going to assume you go to sleep at some point. Yeah, you know what? I drink and I basically kind of pass out on the table. <laughs> okay. Uh, you you drink to, to your bed by Pidovic. Pidovic just pulling your leg like... Uh, you know, <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. But then, you get, but then you get like up the stairs and you're like... Oh, ah. oh, oh. oh no! You'd be mad, but it's fair. Ah, I'm gonna wake up so damn hungover. Pidwick are actually pretty low strength. Uh, let me check. Wait, how it's strong like is he? I think his strength is like 8 or something. Let me check. Not that bad. I mean, that's pretty bad. It's worse than mine. I oh, know, he has 10 strength. Okay. Uh, he's stronger than me. Okay, let's have Pidwick make a strength check. <laughs> yeah, uh, he really struggles. He spends a lot of time on the stairs. Yeah. Ah, and Gal doesn't do anything. Gal was down there with me. Gal, are you gonna do anything to help Piddlewink? Mom and I are asleep, so we can't necessarily do anything that's calm wake stuff out of nowhere. Cam yeah, suddenly feels the disturbance, disturbance in the soap. He isn't hurting me. He's hurt he. No one's hurting him. He's hurting me. If anything, by dragging me upstairs. Yeah, Piddlewick is dragging Tana up the stairs, and it's not going. Ah! <laughs> uh, at, at any point, does that wake me up? Because I'm assume being hit in the head by stairs would wake me up. Okay, Kyle is helping. Kyle is helping. I am at. Does Gal no. have the real strength? How much wine is left in my bottle at this point, probably, though? None. None. It's gone. The bottle of wine is gone. No! No, it has to be at least half full still. Nope, it's gone. No, it has. Wait, are you saying you took it away from me? Son of a bitch. You were asleep. You only Hello? Gile has the option right now. Dora? Uh, Gile, is, Gile is helping. Well, I mean, I couldn't have. Okay. Sorry, uh, I'm a little issue with my mic. Okay. It's fixed. You hear me? Yeah. Yeah, okay. we hear you. So, what's going on? Uh, so, yeah. Yeah, Gile's okay, helping, so helping you. Okay, so helping you, so yeah, the track you back to <laughs> <laughs> did that? Did he like just see him struggling, pulling me up the stairs? Yeah, probably like. Yeah. You were like uh, to consulting your work. You you were like hitting your head against the floor, like, pow, and then you woke up and you, for ten seconds and you fell back asleep. the next day, like. Yeah, he woke you up, but then he sent you into a coma with the next stair. Son of a bitch. I'm gonna. Oh man. Tomorrow festival is gonna be fun. Yeah, bye. I'm gonna have the biggest fucking hangover now. Uh, Wait, does that mean I get disadvantaged to all my rolls now? Nah, it's fine. Okay, I'm just uh, gonna be really you, irritated. You still get the full rest. Okay. Ah, uh, Snicker, do you have to leave soon? Um. Uh, not soon. I could go another half hour. Okay. Uh, cause uh, if you start another day, you guys are gonna need to make your level up, so maybe you should stop here for today, I don't know. Okay. Do if we're leveling up, that's probably good. Yeah, so... Unless Rebecca uh, wants to do something during the day, like, really quick or something. 
Yeah, if you want to do something before, we can do that. But if you're gonna start a new day, which is gonna be the festival, uh. I probably at this point I'll probably be still passed out on my bed and someone's really gonna have to drag me out of it. I'm not gonna be getting out of the bed because of what happened that night there. Well, let's Rebe let Rebecca do that. Yeah, I'm just I'm just staying passed out on my bed until someone drags me out. Just hurting. Big ass hangover headache. And my bottle of wine's missing! Who the fuck took it? Probably oh. Guile. Or Piddlewick. Piddlewick might have. Did, did anyone take my bottle away? Did anybody take my bottle of wine away? I wanna say I did, but I didn't do anything. Yeah, I kept Davis locked up in the room. He didn't do it. Okay. Wait, so does that mean I still have my bottle? Probably. Okay. Be How full do you think the bottle is still? Like, assuming you think it's half full, I'm thinking. I'm thinking half full. It doesn't take me that. It doesn't take much for me to get completely shit faced because of how small I am. I'm sorry for the interruption. My phone doesn't have manners. By the way, Davis has sent you the answer to your question about how I'm doing. <laughs> so, I'm, so are we done? Uh, I assume so, unless you guys want to do something else. Can I craft, try crafting another soap-based thing really quick? <laughs> sure, whatever. I want to make, make a party it. hat. <laughs> sure, make a tinkering chick. You mean Dex? <sighs> yeah. Party hat! <laughs> okay! You make a funny army of soap, which is completely useless. I make a hat. Hooray. Soap party hat. When you wear it, you, uh, your persuasion actually goes down. Because you look ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> you get a disadvantage on persuasion. No, but it's totally worth it. Just make sure to remember to take it off when you need to make those rolls. Yeah, I'll take the hat off for the rolls. Mm. And with that level up, what is there anything I get? <gasps> and can he dodge? Yeah. Also, I... at level five, your proficiency cases. Don't forget to change that. Oh yeah, I need to check to see what I get too. I don't know. Yeah! <gasps> oh my god! My perception is now 20! My passive per perception is 20. Things have to roll of. Oh my god, things have to roll so high to get past me. Can someone can someone link the book so I can look at that again? Sorry. It's pinned. Is it pinned in the strat chat? Yeah. No, I, I think it's in the main chat. Okay. You can also look it up in roll 20, yeah, it's easy. Okay, starting level 5. When an attacker that you can see hits you with an attack, you can use your reaction to ha health the tar the attack's damage yeah, against you. If you go to roll 20 to the eye tap and you tap in monk, you get like everything. Okay. You get that level up, it's easier. So unless it's a sneak attack, so every- you get an extra attack actually. And stunning strike. Sweet! So if anything- so Also, Snaker, your punches improve, uh, upgrades from D4 to D6. Ooh, D6. Okay, now, do I learn- do I get any new spell stuff? Nope, I'm still the same. Oh well. I haven't been really using that many spells anyways. Cleansing. Yeah, proficiency becomes three instead of two at level five. I'm trying to get all this stuff looked into. I learned two level three spells. Hooray! Dude, this uncanny dodge looks pretty. Uh, it's freaking. It's freaking amazing. Basically, all attacks that aren't like uh, surprise attacks or anything are halved in damage. 
Yeah, one spot on uh, no. Where do you go to edit proficiency? Because I can't find it. Still, that's pretty amazing. Proficiency is... Uh... Oh, and at level 6, I can choose We're two more proficiencies five, right? yeah. in items. I um, in skills. Oh, wait, it did it. On, it's done now. Okay. I think it actually did go by level for that. Or someone fixed it. Okay. Five. Five. Always plus number two. Yeah, if you get 5 key and you get the things, uh, things, uh... Stunning strike and extra attack. Yeah, and you get like, uh, ten, 10 extra healing points. Two yeah. extra healing points, woo! Well, and don't forget to roll your HP too. I like that. Oh yeah. It's the hit dice. Yeah, it's in the hit dice. Extra attack, that's already on top of... So I get 3 attacks with regular yes. unarmed? So you get two oh attacks. Oh yeah, plus, I should roll my uh, hit die. Uh, standing of bluffs if you use a monk weapon. Uh, I'm getting roll low rolls on my hit dies again. I got two. And my punching my. counts as a magic thing now. No, that's a level six. Okay. Can I just make it? Can I just change that five to a? S can I just wait? What did I? Oh yeah, I, ro I rolled the I rolled the that's minimum. The I rolled the minimum. Yeah. Damn it. Well, also take the minimum map because your HP is really low. Okay, rolling hit dice, go. No, wait, no, I rolled a four. <laughs> so I got under minimum. Also, broke your constitution bonus. So uh, I'll just add. make so it 36. Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna say your HP is 20 now, Brock, because you, you, you probably messed up. <laughs> Brock, your HP is so low, you'd need to get at least 20. You are a little yeah. glass cannon. I got it. Uh, but he, 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 forgot to, he forgot to add constitution bonuses, so I'm gonna give him a few extra hit points. <laughs> I'm, not even, I'm just glass. Even 20 is pretty damn low. I mean, I'm at like 36 now. Oh yeah, what's stunning strike? It doesn't. Let me just click on it to see what it is. Uh, I think you have to type it in, so stunning strike. Yeah, monk stunning strike if you type that. So I think 5th level you can interfere with the flow of ki in an opponent's body. When you hit another creature with a melee weapon, uh, with a melee weapon attack, you can spend one key point to attempt a stun strike. The target must succeed on a constitution saving throw or be stunned until the end of next turn. So basically I use one key point to make the attack a potential stun? Yes, and I have to make a constitution saving throw. And if it succeeds, they're stunned until on that for for time. And I do it after I hit with the attack or before I use the attack? Uh, when you hit a creature... No, it's when you hit a creature, you can choose to spend a key point. You don't have okay. to do it beforehand. The way so it's rolled, I, I think. Hit. Yeah. It's that when you hit another creature with a melee weapon, you can spend one key point to attempt to spend a So, yeah, it's <gasps> when you hit. Okay. Ooh! My fists are included. Woo. Ooh! 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 Wait! Wait! My sneak attack! Yeah. Oh, I did it wrong. Dude, we have not been in a battle for a while. I'm kind of I'm kind of I'm kind of like missing. Come on, I want to fight shit now. I can see you too. I can see you too. My perception is 10 right now. There's not that many battles in this campaign. Uh, that's cuz you spend a lot of episodes in the town. Oops. I realized that I've never increased my skills at all. Like, there are a few dungeons that uh, you haven't gone, uh, gone to yet. But yeah, this is also the biggest town in, in the campaign, so... And we're doing Maybe every... The other two towns are more villages, so... Yeah, We've we're... been in this town for like five episodes, I think, now. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like the next the next session will probably be the last time we're in this town or something. Yeah, probably. The festival will be probably the last part in the town. I mean, we pretty much done everything we can in this town so far. The only thing we haven't done is the festival and check out the the the, camp, yeah. the oh yeah and the basement thing and and the Vistani camp. But yeah, you've you people. Need the basement. basement might have story shit. Yeah, the basement could be very dangerous and deadly though. I don't want to go there. Hmm. Well, you don't have to. <laughs> Plus, it requires sneaking into a place that already could be hostile against us. I mean, I, I can be invisible. 
Yeah, but that's one person versus whoever knows what's down there. All I know is we're. <laughs> all I know is shit is going to go down next session. I just know it. Shit always goes down during festivals. I say we enjoy the festival. We should go bobbing for apples, do those little cute games that are always rigged. <laughs> Fiddlewind could maybe dance. <laughs> oh, we'll enjoy that. Nobody would enjoy that at all. Uh, Piddlewick has gotten better at his dancing. Yeah, Piddlewick has been doing pretty well. So, is everyone gonna be here t next week? No, Guy won't. Yeah, Guy said he wasn't gonna be available next week. Do we play without him, or do we wait? Or replant it to another day? Thing bad, are you gonna be okay? Oh, Missy, I don't think he's available any day next week. Oh, shit. So, it's up to him. Should we play without him, or... Is that a day you're there next week? I think we should wait. Mm. Kyle is pretty good at talking to people. <laughs> when he's not trying to convert them. Oh, my colleague. Uh, and, uh, what day are you back? My sleight of hand is rivaling yours, Evie. Okay. So, uh, bitch. Maybe you can try playing the seventh. Would you uh, guys be there? The Monday? Yeah. Monday? Uh, I'm, yeah, I'm good. I'm good Monday. Too nah. Nah. Wait. No, because he works on Monday, okay. I'm um. good every day. Wait, the sixth? Oh, she. Uh... My other campaign is being is trying to reschedule, so I'm not sure on Tuesdays, still. Okay. But Tuesdays might be a possibility. Oh god, the song is returned. That's a good song. Oh yeah, I should probably take away one of the golden rings. Oh yeah, because you gave it to the... Uh, the yeah. guy. I, 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 I know his pain. And Nico uploaded. Yay, right on time. Yeah, that was a while ago, actually. Yeah, well, I just got to YouTube alert. Okay. I need to. <laughs> I need to take another skill. I got a lot of points. Why is your stealth so damn fucking high? Is it mine? I'm the sneaky one. Because I took one. stealth as a skill. I took stealth as a skill. Yeah, and you got high dex, so it makes sense. Yeah, but monks are uh, one of the most lucky clans. Mm. Actually, they, they got they got one of the kids that like spells. Spell Special Shine, it's a Way of the Shadow, that's basically a ninja. <laughs> the yeah, ninja sure. monk. I wasn't sure if I was gonna try to be a more evil party member or not, but then Please the don't. way the party developed, I ended up being kind of more on the good side, but mostly neutral. Blaze. You like yeah, the I... Man of the group, uh, apart from the obsession from Soap. <laughs> I'm, I'm... The thing is a little weird, but other than that, I'm pretty normal. I'm a fucking thief, and I'm more on the good side of shit. I may end up just being chaotic good at this rate. Yeah, probably. If I do anything to betray the group, it's gonna be when the session is ending for the last time and party members are dying. I am gonna refuse to die. I am not gonna let Tana die. I love her way too fucking much. And I wanna continue with her in other campaigns if that's possible. I'd rather retire a character because they're dead rather than we just stop playing with them. That's kind of my opinion on it. This isn't how it works, Gravy. No! We'll see how it ends. This, this, this campaign can still go anyways. 
Yeah. 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 We, we, we apparently avoided a really high death area, so we've already. By just. By legit the most simplest of plans. Burn the yeah. house down. Just, just burn the damn house. Well, it only works if it's daytime, so I should. Can, can I assume that um, we're not going to see that guy again? Uh, the coffee maker? Probably not. Was What was the basic thing for like what to do with him? Just be terrified and not want people inside his house? Yeah, that's all. And, uh, but yeah, this thing also said if you break into his house, he will immediately start talking. So. Okay. Which I did. I was like, the, there is no other way we could go about this. Everything... All accesses you were locked to off. To the mayor and asked for help, and he would have given you four guards to help the demons of vampires, but then they would have arrested him. Yeah, they'd arrest so him. So we did but the. Yeah, but, but those guys have like a 13 hit point or something, they would like die when one hit against yeah, the vampires would, anyway. The guards would die. Vampires don't as fuck out. <laughs> so, by doing the most stupidest thing was actually the way that lead to the best ending of that situation. <laughs> No, the stupidest thing would have been individually lighting the coffins on fire. Or trying to stake them one at a time. No, no, because I mean... If we lit one coffin on fire at a time, that would wake up the others, because we had the stealth roll to get past them. That was why I was against that. I, I can't believe that idea of that freaking plan actually worked, though. And everything's actually pretty plan. fine! It wasn't ah. a bad plan. <laughs> This, that's what the player homework says, I copied it in Discord. The characters report the thief of the bones to his knights and detaches four guards and retires the bones. If the guards show up during daytime hours and surrenders himself in the bones without a fight, claiming that the vampires forced him to steal the bones. If the guards come at night and surrenders himself until the guards their bones are hidden, but he wouldn't retrieve the bones himself for fear of being killed by the vampire. We legitly got the best ending of this situation by yeah, just burning the house down <laughs> the best endings come from the creative ideas indeed dude and the fact it wasn't one of the pyro's ideas it was my idea mm. we were all discussing the idea i'm the one who started and pointed it out first really though don't take this idea don't take this away from me <laughs> i supported the idea When Cam supports the idea, it's probably an illogical idea. I'm just wondering, what would happen if we failed our stealth roll? Would we have been arrested for causing I a fire? Worried, I was worried I failed the stealth roll when we were sneaking past the vampires. Because uh, I only had like a 13. Yeah, but the vampires are well asleep, so you didn't need to roll high. Uh, uh, oh, you mean uh, if you, after you left the house, you mean? Yeah. Yeah, you'd be as worried when we left the house. You would probably have been spotted, and then, uh, yeah, the mayor would, uh, you, you probably would be interrogated. But, uh, yeah, nothing bad. And uh, if you if you explain that uh, you, well, uh, you killed vampires, so they would have let you go, but, yeah. Yeah, but, I yeah, mean, I to, even I if it would have turned out okay, Tana would still not, would still not want to be in that fucking situation at all. They're just gonna give you alcohol and you're gonna tell them everything. <laughs> Not that much. Well, no way. I am that bit. Oh my god, I am a loud mouth when I'm drunk. <laughs> Fuck! Davis is just gonna keep trying to do weird things and they're just gonna be like, get the next guy. This guy's weird. Yeah. <laughs> they probably. It's, they would probably. It's, no, they. No, he already casted a firebolt, so they would have seen that, saw him, connected, and like. Just automatically throw him into the stocks again. Oh yeah, he'd just be putting stocks. <laughs> yeah, because he because he's the one who threw fireballs like the other day. I'm not sure how Rebecca would react in that situation. We haven't been arrested with her yet. Eh, she would probably just uh, think that what she would she do. I'd say she'd yeah, just that, be honest, really. Yeah, that one's harder to say. Cause please don't. <laughs> Please don't. <laughs> Please don't what? Don't you just gotta tell them there were vampires. You see, there was a spider in the house. <laughs> there was a vampire spider. Lots of vampire spiders. They laid eggs. It was also, very scary. Also, my dog is doing yoga poses. <laughs> I 
I think at this point we should probably end the stream now. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. I assume the stream was still going. That's yeah. why I was still talking. Yep. Okay. Thank you for watching, whoever you are. Goodbye. <laughs> Thank well, you I... for staying so long. It shouldn't have lasted here. <laughs> Upvote if you too would end up in jail for burning a house down because vampires were inside. Never give the gnome alcohol. <laughs> Bye.